Hello. <laughs> Hello. Hi, hi, hi. Okay, now you now you hear me. Now you do know you hear me. And then let me immediately go into the game just, just in case. But yeah. How are you guys doing? I have a new thing on my on my stream by the way, which is actually kinda neat. I have, I have installed a new um extension basically. It's like a free thing extension that puts uh, mm -hmm. a clock on your stream that it, like translates your time but also like has like oh. cycled in uh Twitter, art tag, uh, YouTube channel, all that kind of stuff. It's kinda neat neat. Oh yeah, I'm seeing that. That looks really cool. Yeah, it's like easy to set up. It just gives you like an editor and such, and such, and and, and, and it's zero dollars. So you give you give you an editor, right? And then you oh. edit, edit, modify it how you want, and then you download the HTML file, and that's it. <laughs> that's pretty much it. <laughs> <laughs> I always forget that it's like two in the morning for you. <laughs> ah yeah yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> now people now people can uh now people can call me out on how late I stream. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> because until then I had the shield of time zones. It's like, oh time zones here, time zones here. No no now it's uh now it's straight up, oh you're you're streaming at seven AM in the morning, sure. <laughs> yeah. Hey, Duro! Let me do something in here. There you are. Hey, Zapelli! How you doing? Boogie! Hi, Theo. Hi, Ashral. Something. Okay, let me see. Hi, Theo. Hi, Ashral. Test. Okay, cool. Okay, okay, okay. Let's close this. And yeah, we, 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 I'm just, I was just basically setting up the uh, VTC bug in the background. So we are back once again uh, to finally start with the Eclipse arc. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, it's gonna. Uh, it's gonna be interesting. First, first and foremost, we we usually we do the usual thing of of rolling gacha, because gacha. <laughs> gotcha. Because gacha, you cannot live without gacha. In a gacha game, that is, you can live without gacha when it, when there is no gacha involved. Yes. Naya, Hestia, Kitty Eyes, cool, cool T Eyes. Okay, now, no, 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 no. Now we're gonna we spend two marks on this guy. Hopefully. Yes, yes, yes. Also, let me see something real quickly. Uh, say something? Yes, hello. Something, okay. something. Okay. Then words. Can. Yeah, words, okay. words, 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 words. I was just basically... Uh, raising you a little bit. Oh, Beata, nice. Ruin, obviously. Okay, 
Okay. I see. The game audio is working. The mic, the uh, Discord is just should be okay. Let me pull this. Hmm, let this. And yeah, okay, cool. We're good. We chill. We chill. Okay, and now um, let's spend ten to ten on these. Ten rolls here. Naya. <laughs> Not not much to do, get from here. No no no. Gotcha addiction never ends, A. Eh? It never ends. Gotcha addiction never ends. The gotcha addiction never ends, A. Eh? Okay, now I need to just restart at this point. The gotcha addiction uh, never ends, and uh, just as heroes never die. <laughs> <laughs> The gotcha addiction never ends, A. Eh? Yep, I fixed it. But I love how the, this this is the message Moon you decided to repeat. Gotcha addiction never <laughs> ends, eh? Gotcha addiction never ends, eh? And like, yeah, thank you. Thank you for... Uh, um, <laughs> thank you, Mooney. Thank you, Mooney. Yeah, I appreciate, I appreciate that uh, shade. She, she throws shade at me even when she's not sentient. What the hell is that? <laughs> swear to God, I will... I swear to God. Okay. And we finally arrive in the Eastern Alliance. Which, uh, if I remember correctly, was the bane of uh, a gig ex 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 existence. Yeah, he mentioned that. <laughs> So, yeah, that's going to be something to deal with. Is the sound all right, Zapelli? I'm just need to I need just need to check just check 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 <laughs> check 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 I need to check if the sound is okay so we can continue playing the game and, and like uh, streaming and stuff. Uh so well, I'm fine on your end. Okay, cool. Thank you. Volume's fine on my end. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Now we're gonna begin the first chapter of Caged But uh, of the game uh, Eclipse Cage Caged Butterfly, which starts with view from a cage. Goodness, what a joyful, what a joyful beginning! Tindo ima. Okay. I like how it's very Japanese themed. Yep, it's it's clearly it's it's Eastern Alliance, so everything is Eastern. I mean, yeah. Yeah. Hmm. 
No, I think I'm gonna read it. Pray for peace. For okay. peace, we pray. Our shamans dance the, the night away. Heaven and earth, incessant, incessant spin, blessing water, fog, and wind. It's nice to hear that song again. Time again for the peace ceremony. I wonder who the three tribes will send to serve as shamans. Hmm. Princess, your highness, please, it's time for lunch. I'm not hungry. Go ahead and eat first. Princess, if I may speak plainly, your diet has not been stable recently. If something happened to you, well, we would all be at a loss. Miss Gia Nama, maybe the princess really isn't hungry. Yeah, Tinko Jianama. It's like Korean also. Korean, Inama. Japanese. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Korean, Japanese, Chinese probably as well. Mm hmm. Tinko, don't you interrupt. I am the princess nanny. I have accompanied her since birth. And must see to it that she's well cared for. If I do not fulfill this sole duty of mine, then my life is meaningless. <laughs> Understood. Fine, I'll eat. I don't wish to cause you trouble, Gianama. Oh, what's been going on with old Gia? She's been so cranky recently. You can't blame her. Her son should be turning 11 years old soon. Really? So he'll attend the metamorphosis? Yes, she hasn't seen him in nine years, all because of me. Even on his most special day, she's unable to return. Princess, what's the matter with you? What does Piplip the Penguin Pokemon reminded you of? I was wondering where Butter went. Madam, you're not keeping it inside you again, are you? Pipelp reminded me of King Day Day Day's kid. Hmm. Piplip, Piplip, Pip, 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 Pulp. Uh, Pokemon. Huh, interesting. I had an interesting question. Uh, what does what does Pip, Piplip the penguin Pokemon remind you of? Um, of a penguin. <laughs> of a penguin, yeah. It's basically a penguin. I mean, did it is kid? Uh, kinda, maybe. I don't know. It's just a normal peng normal normal penguin that is like kind of cute. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't help myself. Not good. The butterfly is not suited for this environment. 
keeping it inside will only make you uncomfortable. Put it back in the cage already, will you? Butter. Princess, are you feeling any better? Hi. Much better. It's just... <gasps> Being trapped in a cage like that must be so lonely. Not at all. Look how pretty Butter is. Even locked in a cage, it gets pr plenty of attention. That's a, f that's a fat analogy right there, game. I see you. <laughs> I see you. I see what you're doing there. I see what you're doing, game. That's a, like a big fat analogy, I would say. <laughs> you know, Butterfly in a cage, so it gets so lonely, but no, it's so cool. It's so, ka it's so kawaii, secretly. See what you're doing, game. Mm -hmm. I see what you're doing. <laughs> I still don't think it's as beautiful as your firefly. Hinduimu! Okay. What? Right. I'd never expect you to be so petty. I do not- I do nothing to provoke you, and yet you go behind my back. What? Miss Himawari, I don't know what you're talking about. Doesn't that mean sunflower? Yeah, Himawari. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Playing dumb? Seriously! It was decided long ago that I would serve as wind shaman for the peace ceremony. You must have been speaking ill of me to Huan Yun. Otherwise, why would he suddenly change his mind? The shaman should be the one from each sect. Why would he pick our princess? Miss Himawari, there must be some misunderstanding. <laughs> I am speaking to your princess. I usually show respect as you are the princess of the insect tribe, but do not think uh, that I fear you. Must I remind you who it was that begged us for forgiveness? <laughs> you know exactly what I'm talking about. A political hostage should act accordingly. Behave as you ought to before trying to take what isn't rightfully yours, first ask yourself whether or not you deserve it. The princess was absolutely unaware of this. I would not lie to you, Miss Himawari. Please go ask Lord Huan Yun himself. 
Well then, you dare question me as well as insult Lord Huan Yun? You dirty little bug. I wouldn't dare. I just think you've misunderstood Princess Tinduimo. Pinko, enough. You may leave. But we really didn't recommend you to the Lord Huan Yun Princess? Regardless, at least you're the true heir to the insect tribe. Himawani may have been taken in by the wind sect. But she was still born into the leopard tribe, part of a fog sect. She was she has just as little of a right to be wind shaman as you do. Pingo. Impudence. Ah! It appears that your princess has not taught her subordinates how to speak properly. I shall do it for her. First, I shall tear open that eloquent mouth of yours. You! You sh didn't expect her group to be so strong. Get off! Did you not hear her? Let, let the lady go. It's not gonna be pleasant a pleasant story, isn't it? <laughs> okay. She's pretty strong. Think you'll get away with this? I did not do well teaching my subordinates. Forgive me for upsetting you, Miss Himawari. I'm afraid your hand has been injured. I shall pay the price myself. Ow. Oh. You? If you are still not satisfied, I will cut deeper. I enough! <laughs> For the time being, it appears you are sincere. Oh, okay, she's, she's a bit hardcore, isn't she? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> But don't let this happen again, or next time, I won't be so forgiving. Oh, she knocked down the yeah. thing. Tingo, are you alright? It's fine. Princess, you really do care about me. I got it.
them. Stop it, damn you. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Lots lots of more uh art this time around. Mm-hmm. Trying to get away again, are we? You know you can't hide that natural beauty. The future king of the insect tribe has already picked you to stay by his side. Ah, yes, natural beauty, natural beauty indeed. Oh, hi. Hello. Mm, hello. Bug! Thank you for the subscription. <laughs> Ow. Oh. Yeah, we did. We did establish that she gets really. Um, she she doesn't. She does. She gets like. Uh, fairly hurt by the presence of the butterfly. Uh, in her system. Mm -hmm. So obviously, standing on the roof and the butterfly go, go, goes in the inside. She's gonna lose lose balance. <laughs> <laughs> so it makes sense. Yeah, it makes sense. Yeah. What a start, huh? You already established that uh, calling Tinduim an, an underdog would be un would be an understatement. <laughs> yeah. Seemingly nobody nobody likes her. Like nobody likes her. <laughs> <laughs> That's. That's gonna be rough. The wind shaman. It's kind of curious how this guy has like a. That's the first time I've seen like a animal person depicted in a wheelchair. I gotta be honest. Oh yeah yeah yeah. So, I love the music though. It's so whimsical. Yeah. Well, what's going on here? He's wheeling her in, isn't he? <laughs> yes. <I am. laughs> Hello. Is that Lord Juan Yun? Why are you carrying the princess? I've fallen and I can't get up. <laughs> oh, he's a uh, he's pretty handsome actually, I'd say. Yeah. Hello, ladies. Don't worry, it's not what you think. Uh, probably. <laughs> <laughs> eh, eh? She's not listening. <laughs> <laughs> Lord Huan Yun loves to joke around as always. I twisted my ankle. Juan Hyun offered his assistance. Help me down. Mm, yeah, he kind of uh, he he's, he kind of sounds like a bit of a joker. I gotta admit. Mhm. Mm interesting. It's even more interesting that he's a jolly person in a wheelchair. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, Princess, really, how on earth did you twist your ankle? I wasn't paying attention, and I slid down from the roof. Thank you for your help. A lucky coincidence that you happened to be nearby. A coincidence? Maybe I just wanted to see you. Wink. <laughs> no, wink, wink. <laughs> She's having none of that. <laughs> <laughs> She's having none of it. Mm. Well, it has been a while. You know you're allowed to joke around sometimes too, princess. Mm. Really though, some here Mavari come through here looking mad, so I came here to make sure everything was okay. But as you know, not the fastest quilling in the East. 
God damn it. Yes. Haha. <laughs> 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 there was just a misunderstanding with Himawari. She's very protective of you, you know. Everything is fine, Huan Yun. It's not fine, though. Uh, I know what that must have been about. It's my fault, really. I appreciate your concern, Huan Yun. But please don't worry about it. Yeah? Well, that's a lot of. I was worried there'd be another way you'd agree to this. Uh, well, let me ask you formally. Princess Tinduemu, I, Lord Juan Yun of the Quillin tribe, formally invite you to serve as the shaman for the wind sect. Wait, what? So Himawari was... Obviously she was correct because she heard that Yuan, uh, Juan Yun chosen her, but she wasn't... But obviously Himawari thought that it was because of Tinduemu, but Tinduemu didn't know anything, and now... <laughs> now she knows. <laughs> now she knows. Now she knows. The peace ceremony is to celebrate peace. A new princess represent the alliance's peaceful relationship with the insect tribe. I mean, it's a good point, actually. Mm -hmm. If if anything, it would it would uh, it would be a good PR move, like overall. Mm -hmm. Like, look, yeah, we, we yeah. have this uh, we have this good relationship with the with the with the na nation that we have an army a a war with, like a few years ago, and have a political hostage there. Look at this political hostage is willing to represent their tribe, so that means uh, that, that means we have a good relationship. Yay! <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't think of a more suitable wind shaman. Lord Wan Yun, I know you love to tell jokes, but this is too much. Eh? Am I actually completely serious? Why would I joke about this? Then let me stop this right here. No, I cannot accept your invitation. And why is that? I am an insignificant political hostage, not suited to fill such a high position. What's more, the Wind Sect will hold the ceremony this year, which means even more eyes will be on the Wind Shaman. <laughs> you were thinking it. You are the prince. You are princess of insect tribe, bestowed with such natural beauty. Who could could be who could be more fitting? It's not that easy. This guy is so naive. Yeah. I'm truly not worthy of your kind words, but I sprained my ankle. Mama. That's no problem. There's plenty of time before society. When you rest up first, we'll talk about everything else later. Mm. Well done. It's getting you late. I'll see you all later. They will, in fact, see him all later. I, I, I already see his type. I already know mm -hmm. his type. He's like, I I'm going to do this. <laughs> uh, does he really not get it? Or is this some kind of long con? He's like, I'm going to do this. And then he will proceed to, I will guarantee it, he'll proceed to return every single fucking day asking the same question. <laughs> <laughs> Like it's like you won't you, let up. <laughs> would you would you like to be a uh, would you like to be a wind shaman? For, uh, uh, she opens the closet to get her food, and then Zhuo Yun. Would you like to be a wind shaman? She lay, <laughs> she lays down in bed, opens her covers, and there's Yuan Zhuan Yun. Would you like to be a wind princess? <laughs> He's like like a spider monkey on the ceiling. Like, would you like to be a wind shaman? <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. She goes outside on the balcony, letting, uh, getting a wind, a, a fresh, a fresh wind, uh, fill her lungs, and there in the bushes, Yuan, Juan Yun. Would you like to be the wind president? <laughs> <laughs> I just see the the, the the colorful picture of that happening. <laughs> Princess, you got to tell that guy. No way. What do you know? 
she is showing him respect. Now quit complaining and tend to the princess's ankle. No need. I did it on purpose. I was worried that Himawari was serious, so I twisted it just in case. Didn't think it'd come in handy so soon. Tingdo Ibu is being way too hardcore, count number two. Mm hmm. <laughs> I'm just afraid that even after taking such extreme measures, he still won't give up. Probably won't. <laughs> that child does nothing but joke. Why would this time be any different? I bet he's already forgotten about it. Oh, you wish. <laughs> <laughs> that would be great, but it doesn't change the prince's ankle situation. Oh, I love the tra I love the transition effect. Mm-hmm. Aw, this is actually really atmospheric. They really upped the ante with their presentation in Eclipse, huh? Yeah. Okay, uh, next time he appears, I'm gonna do this. Deja vu. <laughs> <laughs> For some reason, for some reason now, officially in my brain, uh, that just had an idea. Every time Joan Yoon will appear, Deja Vu will be playing in my brain. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, didn't mean to scare you. I was in the area, thought I would come, che come check up on the princess's ankle. Welcome. It hasn't healed completely, but it does seem to be a bit better. Fantastic! <laughs> See, you'll be great at summon. <laughs> <laughs> well, the physician says that I should really stay off it for a while longer. I think Himawari will have to be the shaman this time. I see. Okay, then I'll think it over. But don't you go giving up on me now. I'll see you soon. <laughs> you mean you're... Going to come back? Give up, Ted Luimo. Just give up. <laughs> he's going to he's going to be in your walls for the foreseeable future. <laughs> <laughs> Naturally. Ah <laughs> <laughs> uh, fucking hell. What a <laughs> I like him. <laughs> I like him. <laughs> Even a day without you seems like a lifetime princess wink. <laughs> Wink wonk. <laughs> She's just, she just lost for words. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Speaking of <laughs> Oh, there he is again. Yeah. He comes every day. I feel tired for Tindu Imu just watching. I just realized this is the, the mm -hmm. he has the power. He has the strongest power ever. The power of an extrovert. <laughs> oh no. He's an extrovert. Oh god. Oh no. <laughs> He's an extrovert. He's a flirty, joke, jokey around extrovert that will that really really wants to help you <laughs> he will really <laughs> wants to help you <laughs> perhaps he is serious you mean he seriously loves causing trouble both <laughs> you you are much too inexperienced Lord Huan Yun, I thank you for the invitation, but by now you must know what I think about the matter. I think Tidu Maria tries to do the utilize the same uh, dancing around the dancing uh, around the things kind of approach, 
Or just like uses the court language, basically. Oh Lord, you and you would you would be. Uh, it's like uh, it's now you know that the thing that they I would love to you know the twenty pages of pream preamble to say that fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Kind of situation, but then on on his side he proceeds to proceeds to um to pretend like this entire twenty page of dialogue just kind of went over there like override over his head boarded the plane and 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 went to mexico all of that just like boarded the plane went to mexico right over his head <laughs> <laughs> and he's like <laughs> and he hears what he wants to hear which is and he replies in a completely casual tone <laughs> <laughs> she's completely lost how to deal with him <laughs> Because all her life, she dealt with people who were like all this oh, ha, 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 veiled, uh, veiled, corrupted, this kind of like uh, double faceness. He's being absolutely mm -hmm. frank with her, which is kind of disorienting. <laughs> The, ha the heart is like a drifting cloud, ever changing. A sincere heart can bend uh, even the metal and stone. <laughs> so I shall return tomorrow. <laughs> oh my goodness. Bye bye. 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 Have a great time. <laughs> bye. <laughs> Clingy men. An independent woman's worst nightmare. Damn. Frill, frill. <laughs> <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> it's like, I know where you live. <laughs> It's not like you're going anywhere. Yeah, it's not like it's not like he could go anywhere. <laughs> Princess, that guy's seriously a pain. You got to give him a piece of your mind. Really make him cry. There's no way he'd bother you after that. You underestimate the power of optimistic, of the optimistic <laughs> in extroverts. You really do. <laughs> oh, Ting, you should know there's some people you just can't defy. Life's more complicated. And make him cry? That's not something Tinko would usually say. She didn't ask Jihasa Jihasaha, did she? Yeah, Jihasaha. Uh, yeah. We actually saw it's the beetle. It's the beetle guy. Yeah. The big, the big, the big, uh, the big beetle guy person thing, man. <laughs> uh, be beetle manly man. <sighs> so you both can't think of anything, huh? Why don't tell me what's in your mind? I, can, I could think of something. Deja vu. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. What are you doing here? I'm just uh, driving around, you see. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Wawa, well, uh, I come in peace. I surely wasn't following you or anything. I will, no, I right. will, I will come you. <laughs> <laughs> oh uh, my goodness. Actually, well, uh, it's a long story. Make it short then. Well, the moon was looking so beautiful, so I wanted to share it with someone just as stunning, and Tinko said you went out, so... It must be fate that they found you here. Uh, I thought with me being so slow and all. <laughs> Speaking of which, your uncle seems to be doing much better. Yeah. Not yet. You must be mistaken. <laughs> must be mistaken. <laughs> but I can see it right now. It's clearly... Enough, Lord Huan Yun. How long do you wish to push me so? Watch out! Oh, wow. Okay. 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 
Who are you? Oh. Oh, hi. Hmm. Die, maggot. Uh, okay. G good moves there. Good moves there, Yon Yon Yon. Good, good moves. <laughs> okay. Let me give exhaust. What are you doing? Hmm? Oh, nice. Okay. Oh, okay, so he controls wind. Okay, okay. Let's see. Okay. Okay, let's see. Hmm, so he has she has like stances. Cool. That's, that's how it, that's how it is okay bonk bonk okay we got it huh he's pre he's a pretty good he's a pretty good uh, support he's a really good supporter huh? yeah he does damage he does a uh, shielding pretty decent shielding actually don't you run away Don't chase them. They're surely prepared an escape route. Who dares intrude on Quill and Len so boldly, attacking their lord? What if they were even more determined, unafraid to die? Would you be able to stop them then? I... Indeed, that was a close call. <laughs> I'm too slow. I'm not the most skilled martial artist. But you still tried to protect me. That assassin was clearly heading towards me. A pretty good in trouble. How could I not help? I'm a gentleman, you know. Wink. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I wasn't joking. Serious. Maybe the princess thinks my handicap disqualifies me from uh, rescuing damsels in distress. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. No, I didn't mean. Please don't take it that way, Lord Wan Yun. Oh, stop! I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, I know what you're thinking. You think the Quillin tribe sends the assassin on purpose? These assassins on purpose? You. I may be slow, but I did pick up on that. No, I wouldn't dare. That's not. That's in fact what is what what she is thinking. It's just that, as a political hostage, I'm worried that if I died, no one would be able to hold back the fires of any longer <laughs> the princess temperament is just uh the princess's temperament is just like her injury changing so fast i can't keep up <laughs> <laughs> what nonsense my ankle healed days ago Mm -hmm. 
So you think some of us want uh, another war, huh? It's true, the alliance has formed a vari by various eastern tribes. Even though a peace treaty has been established, it's hard for some people to forget past feuds. Besides that, there is also a lot, of to a lot to gain from war. You see quite clearly, my lord. <laughs> princess, these matters pain me so. Something as obvious as this, and yet I still I need the princess to remind me. In name, I am a guest here, but in essence, a hostage. If I serve as the wind shaman, and a dispute arises as a result, it may be used as an excuse for war. I cannot bear to think of what might happen. Since I came to the East Alliance at 11 years old, I've only wished to live in peace. I wish you the best, my lord. I understand. Thank you. So if the people think agree that you're a guest of the Trukulin tribe and not a hostage, then there should be no issue, right? Oh my goodness. Huh? N no, that's not what I meant. Uh... Princess Tinduimu, allow me to see your home, will you? Never give up. Never surrender. <laughs> <laughs> he, he he did watch he watched he watched that video of uh, the Japanese fisherman like never give up. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Okay. Um. Okay. Let's go. 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 let <laughs> uh. Also, holy shit, biscuits! The story is increased. It's been only two chapters. Uh, it's been only two chapters, and it's already been forty minutes. Mhm. Mm I am a whole hour late, skull. Well, you only missed this and this. You only missed that. Ma missed this and this. So, the view from the cage and wind, wind shaman. So honestly, you you didn't you didn't miss much, honestly, Eggy. Yeah, because we did start a little late. Yeah, we did start a little late. So yeah. Uh, we also basically spent like a while rolling and discussing stuff, but yeah. Okay, first impressions. Tinduimu is hardcore as fuck. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> She's hardcore. Uh, second, <laughs> presentation increased tenfold. Yes. The entire, like, vibe of the game completely changed. Like, they, they are, it's like, it feels like they are, they are adding so much budget to it, right? Mm-hmm, yeah. She is. Yep, I agree, I agree. She's, like, absolutely uh, insane. Even before that, I loved her design. Her her character only adds to it because she's so determined and absolutely not reckless but like fearless in a way. Like she she isn't afraid for herself in the slightest. Like there is no there is no fear for herself there. Others yes, herself no. <laughs> and you Yuan Yu Yuan Yun is um. Is certainly a specimen. <laughs> Joan Yun is a specimen. <laughs> uh, we, we, uh, we, you missed this, but every time he appears on the screen, I'm starting to sing Deja Vu <laughs> because he's really in. <laughs> Uh, 
How ironic! The diplomat sent to patrol She's the insect got trap. Core martyr vibes going on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyway, congrats on starting Eclipse. God damn. He's ready for me to get super toxic. Oh, uh, man. <laughs> toxic eggy egg, I see. The diplomats sent to patrol the Instinct tribe and our esteemed guest, the princess of that very tribe. This dummy. I'm just gonna start ignoring him. You will not succeed. <laughs> No wonder the Quillian's chieftain is always worried about this tribe, his tribe's future. When you have, what do you have you ever heard of walking a political hostage home, let alone bringing one to Alliance Hall? Did they just not just say that Tindy was our esteemed guest? If more a reason to keep her safe in Quillian territory, we'll be heading out soon and can't have you miss messing around like this. Men. I told you this would never work. Uh, yep, definitely not working out like I thought it would. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, quick, bring Long Jian Yun and the princess tribe back to the Quillian territory. This is the Alliance. I'm afraid a reckless use of force would sully your good names. Please, everyone relax. I will handle this. Ooh, she's pretty. She is pretty. Hmm. The Arbiter of the Alliance is here. Please be just in your judgment. <laughs> Arbiter, you're as moving as ever. Lord Wan Yun, enough with the pleasantries. Do you know what a mess you've made? Theo, that is a fish. Uh, Eggy, that is a pretty fish. <laughs> that is a very pretty fish. <laughs> I think very she, pretty fish. I think she's an axolotl. <laughs> you think so? Yeah. Look at the ears format. There's also those blue blue uh, thingies on her head. This is not code, Gios. Hmm. Do not yeah, maybe. yourself with a fish. It's an axolotl, isn't it? Like, the color scheme is the same. She's an axolotl. <laughs> yeah. Super long limb race, yeah. There's no rule against bringing guests along, besides. I merely wish to bring someone back home after many, many years. I'm sure that the Arbiter's heart is as lovely as her looks. She must understand. Is the Quillen Chieftain aware of this? I'm not sure. You might be right. I have never thought too hard about it. She doesn't have a tail, though. I'm not sure, but father is on a faraway journey. Naturally, his son should handle the, his, the, the tribe's affairs. As a descendant of mythics, we must respect you to, to, to some degree. But as for whether or not you may act as a deputy, we'd have to see if you inherit enough mythic energy otherwise. There, be careful with your words. Boca. To be frank, I don't have the best reputation. Father requested I don't leave Quillen territory, I don't concern myself with outside matters. As a result, I've been unable to pay respects to my uncle. This is my own fault. Oh. I didn't think I would be misunderstood to this degree. Is that the spirit wind of the mythical mythical Quillin tribe? Hi. Wind, fog, water. Hundreds of years ago, there existed three mythical factions, embroiled in battle that dispu uh, dis uh, disturbed and angered the holy dragon. Were it not for the Holy Dragon's order for each faction to put aside disagreements, to instead work together to better this great land, then the Alliance would have not be as, it's, as it is today. 
Another dragon story. Interesting. Hmm. And though the insect tribe may not be beasts, they are a part of the alliance now, too. As a descendant of mythics, it, my, it is my responsibility to uphold peace in the East, to treat everyone as equals. This is the true calling of the mythics. Hi. Much more important than summoning some silly spirit wind. Based on the naming scheme of the mystics, Wan, Excellent. But so heroically, I believe this is the chivalrous is spirit that all children of the King. East should have. Yep. Um, the uh, it is basically generally Western Eastern uh, fractions um, of Japan. Which in history, McFuggin hate each other. Oh yeah, Rose absolutely, so absolutely. Three factions. I think three factions are all like a representative of e respectively Japan. China and um, Korea, and they all hate each other in history. So you have to mm -hmm. you, you now understand what type of energy you have in the in the alliance, which is probably alliance just like in in name only, really. And when there's and when it when it's convenient. After hearing Lord Huan Yun's words, would anybody like to add anything? Do not forget the Undumbara left by the Holy Dragon on the top of the Great Hall. Hmm. If not, then as Arbiter of the Alliance, I hereby allow the Insect Princess to go on this journey. However, no attendance will be allowed. Alliance bodyguards will be sent for protection. Journey. I can go? <sighs> Man, imagine imagine being able to, being given the opportunity to go home after being trapped in a in an enemy land for like more than 10 l l little less than 10 years. <laughs> Lord Huan Yun Forgive me my forbid me my, my uck for the trouble Child so that spirit wind you were just bluffing Yeah it <laughs> really took the wind out of me <laughs> oh, Such no. a wimpy little breeze too now you see why my dad why my dad has to look outside to for try for a competent competent competitor competitor for the martial arts tournament. Foolish child, everyone's fate is different. I have not turned my back on you. If I had, would I really give you my only daughter's hand? <laughs> I know, it should be so well. This will not do. I shall call for the Alliance the physician. Large object tied to the dragon. Ha ha ha. Remember the other large objects tied to the dragon. Oh yeah, for sure. For sure. There is a... Uh, I have no doubt that this is... Whatever this is... Uh, whatever the mythical thing it is... Uh, thing majing that is like uh, in the center of whatever... Or at the center of Alliance is another part of the dragon. Zdorika. Because the... Um, the eye... There was a day the eye of the dragon. There was the tooth of the dragon. And now it is some some poor some other part of the dragon. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm not I'm not absolutely not. I am absolutely aware that this is probably some another masked um, story left by dragon tines, basically, or at the very least, influenced by them. Though in this situation, which is surprising, the myth is very much closer to the actual reality, which is Dorica was a dragon. He was an eternal dragon. Right? Hmm. And uh, he kind of did want to... He did kind of pacify everyone, but like the myth, the legend of the Dorica says that he took control of all the people directly, right? He was controlling everyone, so no wars, no, no nothing direct absolute obedience eternal lives that's sort of how it worked mm -hmm. but then uh then the hero vindacti uh rebelled because they wanted the free they wanted freedom even in exchange for losing immortality 
So interesting how yeah. this is a little closer to the original reality, quote unquote. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come, call the doctor. I've already called him. Oh, hello, lady. Hello, there, lady. He's so cute. Uh, Kong Soo Hyun. Yeah, 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 yeah. Korea, definitely Korea. <laughs> yeah. It's funny that the immortals want that back. Izumi and Neo don't come off as people who'd want Why to Why is there a veil over your face? Uh, it's funny that the mortals want that back. From Izumi and Neo, didn't come, don't come off as people who'd want to be under a leash. Honestly, that's true, isn't it? I mm -hmm. feel like who, I feel like the only one who truly wants Dorika back is the quote-unquote true son that they mentioned. The mm -hmm. uh, the biggest the biggest guy around, whatever the biggest person around, the others, including Izumi, are utilize are using the organization as a way to continue their eternal lives with the unperturbed unperturbed. They, uh, Izumi definitely doesn't come off as someone who's um, who's willing to be under eternal leash. Yeah. Um, the 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 neo uh, neo devious absolutely didn't either. Even mm -hmm. I mean he did he, he did literally put steps in to avoid that fate, but also remain impo yeah. immortal. So I guess that's fair. <sighs> he was rebelling against the faction, so I imagine there will be other immortals in the console that will be willing to, um, for some for some reason or other. Uh, detach themselves from Dragon Signs, mm -hmm. I would imagine, because eventually uh, they will realize that this is not a fate they want, uh, and there will be. Uh, and when you pick, when you when you are immortal for a long period of time without without overarching control, you become free spirited to say the least. <laughs> mm. But yeah. Uh. I heard this has been the tradition of the water sect for generations. Once a woman has found a suitor for marriage, she mustn't show her face until she has been formally married. And that's also an old Korean tradition, actually, which is kind of cute. Interesting. Mm -hmm. At least it is like a reference to a tradition. Yeah. I haven't seen her for so long. She's... It appears there have been talks to establish a relationship with the Quillen tribe via marriage. The Quillen, mythical beasts of wind, and the Kyo, beasts of water. Quillen, I imagine. I imagine Quillen are um. Quillen are more. Uh, if the if the three tribes represent different cultures, then Quillen might be Chinese. Hmm, maybe. Quillin is the let me actually check because Quillin is an actual a is an actual ancient beast that actually exists. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. Which which um legendary legends did it come from? Quillin. I believe the insects represent the Mongolians. Yep. Yes, they are in fact Chinese. Ah. Uh. Quillin are in fact Chinese. Kyo is the. Uh... If you're struggling, it's pronounced Kirin. Ah, oh, Kirin. Oh, it's not Quillin. It's Kirin. Okay. Oh, Kirin. Okay. Kirin. Yeah, I get. It. I know Kirin. It's these Chinese beasts. One horn. See the horn on his head. That's basically. Uh... They're basically yeah. Chinese uh, horse beasts, kind of one one horned horse beasts that control mm -hmm. the wind. And Kyo. Are um, uh, are another thing. Beasts of water. They represent uh, what's it called? Korea in this situation. Mm -hmm. So the last would be Japanese influenced, which I imagine are tigers. Mm hmm. Well matched for marriage, indeed.
No need to worry. Our lord just overextended it himself. He will be fine. Wonderful. I would say you need to sit down, but you're already... <laughs> sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> oh my goodness. Please give me some time to smooth out the Lord's uh, Lord's Quee. Thank you, Doctor. Has the Fog Mythic showed their face yet? No, not yet. It's chapter three, so not a lot of people have showed up yet. Suhyun, listening in on others' conversations again, are we? Haven't I warned you? People of the Alliance all have their own agendas. You can't keep running over here. But the princess is going on a journey. How could I not see her off? She is adorable. <laughs> I just love to look. Oh, she's so cute. <laughs> anyway, I've known everyone since I was a baby. They're like family. Nothing bad will happen. Child, you never encountered bad person. <laughs> oh, man. Princess, your humble servant has something to ask of you. What is it? Obviously, if you're gonna see my son, please do, please give him something or whatever. Mm -hmm. Yeah. My son, Faida. Yep, Mongolian. Will soon be 11. Yeah, he will undergo the metamorphosis. Flat spells I hope out. you can give Everyone him this gift for me. Agendas. Yep, that's true. That I can see that. Um, a lot of the time, actually, uh, this seems to be this storyline seems to be inspired largely by the court uh, court stories of the uh, of the of the uh, Chinese uh, folklore and like g general Eastern folklore because. In West, when you come look at the West, when you look at the court, you see br brilliant knights, dragons, open fights, right? Mm -hmm. When it comes to Eastern culture, you see a lot of the backhanded, uh, backhanded um, schemes, holding mm -hmm. the holding the dagger behind your back all the time at all times, like all that kind of stuff, because the, there's such a big influence war happening across the entire empires. Japanese Empire, there was an entire war of influence. Chinese Empire was like coming in and falling apart, like every one hundred years or so. Uh, for a while in the history. Um, even Korea underwent similar processes. Um, you are never safe in Eastern court. Never. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Any drink can be uh, can be poison. Any um, friendly request can be basically a, an excuse of a, for assassination. Anything is... Uh... And one of the most brutal kings ever existed in the East who basically, like, there was there, there have been stories of, like, uh, a queen that decided to, hey, I'm just gonna kill that entire town because I said so. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, there's there's been really brutal things happening in the East in the past because it's such a long history and it's filled with bloodshed and schemes and intrigues and everything. So I imagine it is largely inspired by the uh, mythos and historical revel uh, stories, which is gonna be, which is the fact that there's gonna be a lot of backstabbing here, lots of backstabbing. Mm -hmm. Probably, yeah. Let Sorry me see. For the segues. I have many strong opinions about this season. Oh, that's fine, Eggy. Is this an ornament from the East Alliance? Yes, the insect tribe does not have such exquisite craftsmanship. I hope when my child sees this, he thinks of me. Be that, that's that. I guess that's what that's uh, is in, the entire presentation tries to establish. Beautiful from the inside, ugly from within. Mm -hmm. Princess. Don't worry. I will certainly give it to him for you. Oh, 
Bye, have a great time. <laughs> <laughs>
fine. Even better now, knowing such a pretty girl cares about cares so much about my health. That's great. When uh then you should probably head back to the front with the others. Are you upset about something? I wouldn't dare be upset. She says upset. <laughs> so if you dared, then you would be. <laughs> for, for the political hostage, you are simply adorable. <laughs> oh my goodness. What did you say? She's blushing. <laughs> Stop. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> See, what did I tell you? Perhaps being so close to home, you're, you're relaxed a bit. Yes, this I can understand. Tinda was that one picture of Squidward wearing that I really wish I weren't here right now button when it comes to wheelchair man. <laughs> Tinda is that one picture of Squidward wearing that I really wish I weren't here right now button when it comes to wheelchair man. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. I just ima I just ima I just imagine every time every time she like walks into the room, just like ah finally pee and then suddenly Sounds of wheels. <laughs> <laughs> I also love my home. Lord Wan Yoon, why did you get so serious all of a sudden? Oh, that hurts. The, princi the princess thinks I'm never serious. No, no, you don't appear to be that serious all the time. Yeah, she doesn't see need to say anything. <laughs> 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 just like fuck she got me <laughs> awkward silence <laughs> just like fuck she got me <laughs> what is this <laughs> what is this awkward silence oh my goodness <laughs> hey at least lie made me feel better <laughs> <laughs> oh there's like a, there's like you know there's like tick 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 ding <laughs> <laughs> <feel better. laughs> Forget it. I can't blame you. I know that I get attached to people, places, things much too easily. People say I'm overly affectionate. Keep trying to sweet talk me, buddy. But among them, my homeland takes top priority. You're gonna fall behind if you just vibe here. So please be, right. please believe me that I can understand how you feel. The feeling of being far off or far from one's home. Oh, be careful, they're coming your way! Oh, monsters. Ah, oh, wild beasts. That's not a that's not a good thing. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah, I could feel Tindo just... feel Tindo just holding back a million swear words. Yeah, I could feel, feel Tindo just holding back a million swear words. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's, let's give ourselves some... Uh... What is this? Okay. Oh, interesting. That's what his attack does. He also heals. He heals and then mm. does damage back. Okay. Okay. Yep, I figured. Careful with Wan's skill too and that reset enemy CD to zero thing. What is this? <laughs> she accidentally backhanded Ju Juan Yun too on, on her way back. <laughs> Oh, 
Yeah, okay, he also heals. That's really cool. Okay, he's a really strong support. Accidentally. <sighs> I finally drove them off. <clears throat> Where's everyone else? Don't know. They must have scattered during the chaos. <laughs> Quote unquote, accidentally. <laughs> <laughs> what happened? When I was little, there were no wild beasts around here. Uh, something feels tells me I won't. Uh, I I don't. We, she won't like what she will see back home. Mm -hmm. Something tells me she won't like what she will see home. Oh, what a pain! What a pain! Let's go. If we follow this road, there'll be a village up ahead. Eh? You're a princess, but you've been to those back rows? I am not a lady of the court, if that's what you expect. Oh? It'd be meaningless to say any more. Let's go. I mean, yeah, she's kind of a badass. I doubt she was much for, much for court stuff. Mm-hmm. Girl knows butterfly kung fu. How did this? Girl knows butterfly kung fu. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Uh huh. Uh. Yeah. Yeah. I figured mm -hmm. I figured it'd be something like that. Yeah. Peace my ass. Mm-hmm. Number thirty eight, you weren't here for a roll call yesterday. Speak, where'd you go? Ay ay ay! Louder! You sound like a scared little cricket. Don't you six know how to use your words? Ay ay ay! <laughs> Look here! So scared he can't even talk. Screw it! Doesn't want to talk. That that beat that hell out of him. Beat it out of him. No. Faster, how am, I, how am I supposed to aim like this? Uh, officer, I'm frightened. I can't do this. Oh, shut up. I'm having a blast. If you can't do it, I might as well shoot you dead, maggot. Oi, oi. My brother died at your hands, and you think I've got no reason for revenge? Oh, yeah, it's that. It's that. N no, I'll be paid. Hey, got some good food right here. So well, they're the ones who brought those beasts here. This... this is too much. Does he look like someone who can manage that honestly? Yeah, honestly, no. I feel like this is the... this is the... This is the situation by... where it's like... all of these soldiers who were probably at war... for a long mm -hmm. time... and lost a lot of people. Right? They are now mm -hmm. stationed where killers, literal, literal killers of the family are. Mm. So you can imagine there's a lot of pent up anger and frustration and it's just like every time, like, so there's, there's, a, there's, a, there's a, a bunch of PTSD involved as well because usually there's a lot of PTSD yeah, yeah, with yeah. war. So these soldiers are basically also are venting all of this frustration and anger and, and, uh, grief on people who don't deserve it effectively mm -hmm. because they are allowed to 
Like there's yeah. no, there doesn't seem to be any control over them. So they're just like, oh my god. And that's imagine that's like uh, just like just like an off shoot. Imagine if, it, if 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 it was like uh, placing every uh, relative of the of the died fam of the pe pe people who died during World War Two to oversee Germany. What the fuck would that happen? Yeah, yeah that would that would be absolutely. Uh, and. Geneva would, rolling over in her yeah, grave. Yeah, that would, that would be catastrophic, honestly. But yeah. Mm -hmm. Sir, please, I didn't mean anything by it. I really don't remember where I put it. That's... Oh, wait for me! Aww. So your ankle is healed, I see. Uh, at least, uh, at least try to act the part. <laughs> <laughs> Mm. No passing what idea. Those are rules. If you keep making noise, I'm gonna feed it to the beasts. Please, I'm begging you. If I don't bring this medicine back, my mother's going to die. Tinda really crushed her own ankle to not have to go somewhere with Juan shows a lot about her. Yeah, yeah, I, I know that. Uh, we already said that the, the, the fact that she crushed her own ankle just to not go anywhere probably says a lot about her personality. Yeah. Okay, what does her mother have to do with, any, with, 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 with me? When my mother died, I didn't say any of you come help. Hey, get this dumb maggot out of here. Feed it to the beasts. Stop! <laughs> Who are you? Some instinct dares get in the way of the Alliance army. You got a death wish. <laughs> the insect tribe serves the East Alliance. It's true. But a mere pawn who thinks he can act with authority, you both should learn your place. You crazy, what you? Well then, is the general allowed to act with the authority? Also, I think I mentioned it before, but this battle theme is like one of the only things I like about this season. Makes sense. General Yu. Seems your skill are, the kills aren't bad. Now report your name and purpose for being here while you still have the chance. Ah, man. Yep, the, 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 the tigers are in fact uh, inspired by uh, Japanese culture because General Yu... Um, I'm not sure that they're mythical beasts because Pang didn't really show any mythical beast abilities, and he's a tiger. Mm. A tiger general. Okay. Okay. Let's see. I'm wondering, like, is this what is this? Uh, what is the situation here? Who are the three tribes? Um, we know the the aqua beasts. We know the they they are the water tribe. There's the wind tribe, water, and fire. There are only it? one family of mythics per tribe. Ah, hmm. uh, I see. Persect. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Persect. What is this? You intrude, cause trouble. You won't state your name. Ha! Huh. Huh, trouble. Clearly, it's your soldiers who are causing trouble. An army this undisciplined, and its general completely unaware, ought to cost you your job. My soldiers? Trouble? I'm afraid you're mistaken. My soldiers' actions are completely justified. No, they're not. 
You were aware of this? You deliberately allow them to abuse our people? He's not unaware he is endorsing it. Do you know how difficult it is for soldiers stationed on the borders? The battlefield makes no one go mad. The instant tribe is infuriatingly uncooperative, and yet the Alliance does nothing but... The point is, it's not that easy to lead troops full of point up fent of frustration. They need ways to release their stress, their anger. Twisted, crooked reasoning. Princess? Princess Tenduimu? Yes, and? You still can't do this to civilians. A butterfly with such an imposing manner. It must be. It really is the princess. Tinduimu, the political hostage to Quillin tribe nine years ago. The royal family, no wonder you got such an attitude. Interesting, arrival here, arriving here so suddenly. Could you have escaped and fled home? Not afraid? Bold. Pests, if you want to protect your princess. Feel free to join her, I won't mind. If the royal family didn't surrender for a year of death, we wouldn't have to follow all fall in such a sad state. Yeah, the princess is living a life of comfort in the Alliance. She's basically forgotten all about us. The royal family won't protect us. Why won't we protect her? Plus, how could you... How could we beat the general of the tiger tribe? <laughs> Spineless cowards. I will not permit you to humiliate my people in front of me. Take that back. Mm -hmm. I heard what they think comfort. of you. Why will you speak for them? They're not wrong. The royal family ought to protect them. We have failed our people. Noble. You may be a pest, but you're a royal family. I wish the alliance come would hear you say that. As this is the case, I will do my best to leave your four limbs intact. Wait a moment, General, please stop. Quillin tribe? <sighs> Sir, I'm Joan Yun of the Quillin tribe. I invited the princess come along to come along. She has not escaped. Please understand, General. I'm only equated with the chieftain of the Quillin tribe. I'm unaware of you. You say she was invited here, but do you have proof? Um, we were separated from Arbiter, Arbiter Maedrock and the diplomats. So that means no. You may be descended of mythics, but that doesn't mean if I, I release fugitives on your word alone. The general is not well versed in emotions. It does not matter how you treat me, but as of this beautiful woman... Long ago, the mythics could split mountains and move oceans with their own power. There was not a tiger who could not cower before them. To this very day, respect is paid to descendants of the three mythics. Mama. Thank you, General, you are too kind. <laughs> Yet the power of mythics today pales in comparison to those of old, shameless, using the name of one's ancestor to win favor. <laughs> hey, wait a second. General is mistaken. I would absolutely... It's getting harder and harder to keep this guy out of trouble. Anyway, rec the mythics are all fictional species. Yep, I figured. I only recognize real power, not some empty name. If you're involved in the harbor and you fugitive, I'll take you down all the same. Oh, man. Mm-hmm. The trumpets go hard. 
Okay. Uh, the trumpets go hard. Yeah, they indeed, they indeed do. All the brass winds really. Mm-hmm. Okay, let's do this. Okay, maybe like this. Ooh, nice. Okay. Ooh. Also, to know if you notice, but Wang Yuan can only do horizontal four orbs. Yep, I now notice that officially. Bro cannot reach the other row, LML Nate. <laughs> Bro cannot reach the other row. <laughs> I see. Is that, is that a joke that he's in the wheelchair? <laughs> okay, I see. see uh, and then I'm gonna I'm gonna cast this thing so you don't do those damage and then let's do this uh, stone edge I assume that's 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 that gives protection okay cool uh For the longest time, the only other person who had a horizontal only four orb skill was Roger SP, and I was like, I see a pattern. Okay. Okay, let's, uh. Let's do this. Okay, we did it. As expected, you have some skill. Oh, skills. I'll finish this right here. Ah! Ah. Arbiter Mayok. General Yu, your soldier has already told me what happened. Tinduimu did receive my permission to follow us back to her homeland. She is not a fugitive on the run. Still as careless as ever. The soldiers of the Tiger Trap are dying on the front lines. You bring back an enemy hostage like it's nothing. General Yu, don't speak like that. The Insect Tribe is now a part of the Alliance. We ought to aspire to treat everyone as family. Do I dare ask how many Tiger Soldiers died so the Alliance can, can say that everyone is family? Ah, I... Speaking of the Alliance Army, for many years each tribe has remained peacefully on their own land. Yet it is clear the Tiger Tribe is alone on the borders, fighting your war. Is that it? Isn't that so? That is not true. I propose to send assistance, but... Impudence! If we had not shown great, such great mercy, the heinous crimes of the Tiger King would, not, would, would have sent the Tiger Tribe to... Oh, okay. Enough. We're just here to look around. General Yu, since you are responsible for supervising the insect tribe, please lead the way. The border paths are rugged and craggy. Oh, you watch your precious little steps. To be fair, though, it is kind of fair in a way that Tigers were also kind of thrown under the bus here. 
Because mm -hmm. they did have that situation with the rebellion, didn't, didn't they? Mm -hmm. um, I think it was, it was Yao, uh, the, the old friend of Pang, who was... Yeah, who was basically, um... I note, I noticed how, how the game st stopped even give, uh, equating my level to the level of my characters to the account level. It just gives me level 70 Tindurimo. <laughs> 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 but yeah, so... Uh... I reserve judgment. But but they were kind of thrown under a bus slowly, so, so somewhat. Yeah, they're doing like really bad things right now. But uh, yeah, they they're not exactly the most favorite tribes right tribe in the. We should probably get another tiger perspective first. Yeah, so far all of them are um, angry, to say the least. Scram, who gave you permission to stand around and chat? <laughs> Look at them, they can't even follow a simple rule. That's why cause I, I say the bugs that need the alliance is Easterlies to educate them. Indeed. Look over there. Am I it's hard to, to imagine how, screen? without us, the Is bugs would find a king? way to live. Am I allowed to ask this on stream? Is this a concentration camp? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is basically like, this is blatantly, blatantly referencing this, this kind of ugh, unpleasantness. This is my food stamp for the month. This is what I get for everything I've endured, for swallowing my pride. Nine years, and everything is still the same. Huh. <sighs> Yeah, this is like a very this is like very oppressive, honestly. Mm. You could feel the uh, complete stifle there, basically there. Huh. The view here is much nicer, am I right? Look, head in the clouds. Didn't even notice I came in. Lord Huan Yun, is there something that requires you to be here in the middle of the night? We are still in chapter one too. Oh yeah, it will grow. It will. It, it will be uh, worse. It's one one point six. One point one point five. I think or six, maybe something like that. What is this one before? One point six, I think. One point five, maybe. I, I've come to apologize for that whole mess earlier today. Should have paid me. I should have been paying more attention. Yeah. 
Don't worry about it. If it weren't for you, I wouldn't have been able to come home in the first place. Is that such a blessing in this situation? <laughs> right. All right, Arbiter Mayok My My has sent a message to inform your parents of your return. Someone should be here soon to take you back to the Imperial Palace for a visit. What? But... It's okay. Keep it a secret. Keep it like a secret. Go see them and come back. No, one, no one's the wiser. Thank you. Really. I feel it's still good to be on your own soil after nine years of that rotten cage. True. I suppose that's fair. It's it's still good to be uh, to be home after nine years of uh, imprisonment. Guess I'm not allowed to joke with you too much. Could be dangerous. Huh? Well... Lord Yuan Yun, the instant king has sent the messengers with a letter for the princess. The arbiter has told me to bring him here directly. A letter for me? I wonder if it's like, please don't come. Probably, probably. Child, your mother and I are so happy that you have returned. This is a mag magnanimous and merciful gesture from the Alliance. And I already want to punch her, punch him in the face. <laughs> Who the fuck talks to, her, to, to their daughter like that? <laughs> Imagine if your parent approached you. Child, I am, I am, uh, abs I am, uh, how does it? I am mercifully allowing you to get the Snickers today. <laughs> the Snickers. <laughs> yeah, it's just like it's such a, it's such a, it's just like it's such a magnanimous, a magnanimous. I don't like the way this is worded. A merciful gesture from myself to give you the Snickers. It's like such, such a, <laughs> such a stuck up high and mighty way to tell it. It's like. Oh. God. This is your fucking daughter, you piece of shit. <laughs> As princess, you must act even more in accordance with the rules and not forget this gracious act. Think and act carefully. So basically, fuck off. We don't want to see you. Yeah. As your mother and I have already retired to our quarters for the night, we are unable to meet with you. Wow, lazy ass parents. We hope that after tomorrow's metamorphosis, you can return swiftly to the Alliance. Wow, way to be like, we don't care. We don't give a shit about you existing. What is this? Yeah. You can't, they can't get out, the, get out of bed? You haven't seen your daughter in nine years. It's an excuse. They just don't want to see me. How could that be? If they see me, they'll be accused of conspiring to bring me home. It'll cause trouble. But didn't they say they're happy you're here? <gasps> they're not. They're reprimanding me for coming back so recklessly. It may cause trouble for our tribe. Huh? I actually have a theory on this in hindsight, but I have no proof. To my father and mother, I'm a political hostage first, a daughter second. You have a theory? Interesting. Uh, feel free to tell me when you can tell that theory, by the way, Eggie, because I'm actually curious. You can tell a lot by... Um, by the behavior. 
Mm -hmm. This is what being a hostage means, Wan Yun. Hostage even from my parents' love. It would have to wait till next season. Okay, cool. All right. Well, if he knew that, that why did he come back here? First, you steal my mom. No, you endangered the whole tribe. Were you eavesdropping? And did you say I stole your? Oh. Yeah. Wait. By Faida. Who gave you the right to take my mom away? Does the princess really have that much power? Child, you don't understand. The princess did not go on her own accord. It's her fault, mom's gone. It's, if it's a mis misunderstanding, they just bring her back. Uh. Wait. Hmm? In your hand, is that? My nanny wanted me to give this to him. Her son, for his birthday. Oh? Well then, aren't you going to chase after him? No, he will attend the metamorphosis. I will give it to him then. You can definitely, you can definitely sense a strong sense of anxiety radiating from the story. Mm -hmm. It's like it's a, it's a, it's hard, it's kind of hard not to notice this like heavy feeling. Yeah. Like we do laugh and stuff like that on the jokes, but it's just like it's so it's such a. There yeah. Are no okay, here. it was one six. There, there doesn't seem to be any winners winners here whatsoever so far. Mm hmm. Okay, the metaphor, the metamorphosis tournament territory. So is this like the insect tribe's version of rite of passage? Interesting. I wonder if the princess also had to. You even supervise our ceremonies. It's nothing sacred. Um, princess? Princess? Strange. How does a stud like me keep getting ignored? Glad <laughs> 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 Jadian, can you can you chill? Like, can you can you chill for a second? <laughs> just chill just for a second. <laughs> Esteemed guests, apologies for the long wait. Your minister shall now pr preside over the metamorphosis ceremony. Although the king and queen are busy with other matters, they have ordered me to offer our deepest respects to the arbiter of the alliance. By being below line of sight. And its ambassador should have traveled so far by being the, below the line, the line of sight. Jesus Christ, Eggy. <laughs> <laughs> He's being ignored by being below the line of sight, I see. Uh, oh my goodness.
Well then, let's invite up uh, at this year's group of 11 year olds. <sighs> do we ever do we, do we ever ever see, even see the parents ever? You. Hmm. Forget it. I'll give it to him after it's over. Why do I have a bad feeling? That's probably not unwarranted. <laughs> They're busy being concentrated. They're busy being concentrated, I see. Members of the insect tribe and the insects live in the symbiotic limit in relationships with one another, one another, but this choice is not yours to make. Only the insects, insects know who their most suitable host for them is. Oh, interesting. So they, this is the uh, this is the time where their symbi symbiotic relationships is chosen by the um, by the insect in question. Curious. So it's not them who choose which insect they will be related to. It's other. It's the insects. Interesting. The drums have sounded, marking the time for your fated insects to come forward. Children, you are now responsible adults. Oh. No! Oh, that's a man. Okay. Uh -huh. Mine. App in chat for kids picked by dung beetles. Ice tail moths. How could this be? Yuan Yun, get behind me. Hold him off. What's going on? What about the ceremony? You're too young, and I have never been in battle. You wouldn't know. If a child gets picked by an ice tail moth for symbiosis, they become exceptionally powerful, but also callous, sociopathic, capable of destroying themselves and others. That sounds terrible. Oh no. No! What are you doing? Let me go! Didn't you hear what your Arbiter said? If the children merge with the ice tail moths, they'll be killed! Ah... Uh. Oh, too late. Too late. What are these ice-tailed moth? Hmm. Wonder what what are they? Very annoying in Wonderland trials. That's what they are. Okay, done. <sighs> They're all gone, but... No, it's already finished. They're going to hatch. Gotta think of something. Never mind. What are you doing? Oh no, yeah. it was Faida. Yeah. Suffering my blade and still alive. Worthy of your reputation, I still moth. Oh, I want my mama. Mama, 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 mama. Yeah. 
No. You give me my mom back. Oh, it would be Faida. So this as well. Man, they're going crazy on that piano. Oh yeah. They're going ham on this. Okay, let's see. Like this. And then we attack. Yeah. Listen. Ah, listen to me. Go ahead. <laughs> listen to me. Right Rock Music Company. Ray Art me... Music Company. Ray Rock Music Company. Let me go, Mama. I want my mommy. I want my. Oh, yeah. Mama. You. He. Just shut up. The instant he got in, the, in there with that moth, there was no hope for him. He was only a child! Let me go, or I'll... This is what it means to be a hostage. Those were your own words, princess. If you do this, the more, the more, many more children will die. Please, please restrain yourself. I'm cringing. Oh. <laughs> uh, I am the big sad. Yeah. No, I can definitely see why you have so much strong emotions about this chapter, Eggy. <laughs> <laughs> about this season in general. Oh my god. Though, to be fair, you do have strong emotions about it, so I guess it did its job well. You runs a concentration camp and killed a child on screen and there are people who support him. I hate our community. Ah, yeah. Princess, pardon the inter interruption. Hmm? What is it? What do you, what, was that you're hiding or panicked? It's none of your business. Sorry. 
I know you blame me for stopping you. I'm, I'm sorry. I'll give you three guesses why they do. Um, anyway, uh, I know you want to be alone, but I was asked by someone to give you this letter in secret. In secret? It was sent by the king in Twain. After hearing what happened at the met metamorphosis, they wished to see you urgently to make sure you are safe and sound. After all, your parents still care for you very much. So, are you going to read it? Nope. <laughs> oh, now you did want you to find out why? Why did all those ice tail moths come out of nowhere like that? I, I think I have found the reason. While breeding ornamental insects, an alliance merchant unfamiliar with the insect tribe's ecosystem used the wrong bait. Ornamental insects. I'll bet it's those merchants getting rich off of the war, selling us to the east like toys. Well, when you put it that way. But since they're, in, so they're licensed merchants, my Ugg decided it wasn't worth pursuing any further. Our children, our lives. Is it really up to you to decide whether those things are worth pursuing? Also, give me the answer. I'm not. I'm, I don't think I want to guess why the why people why the community enjoys the uh, general you. Yeah. Clown face. Clown face. Clown. It wasn't worth face. pursuing. It don't look so good. You must be tired. Let's just drop this topic for the entire be for the Your time first being. Guess is probably the right one. What, hot tiger man? First, read the letter. I'll send someone to take you to see your parents. Father, mother, do you know how much I miss you? Yeah. I can't go, she said, yeah. Oh, uh, I can't go. Eh? Uh, but you were so disappointed before. I'm sorry. Please, ready my response. Write that... Tinduimu has duties to attend to. Is it really just Hot Tiger Man? Is it really? If because if it is, it's that'd be kind of depressing. Uh, brother. Okay. Of course it is. The civil war in the Kingdom of the Sun. Of course a it similar is. thing occurring to the Desert Kingdom not long ago. I... Oh, uh... I didn't expect that even the East Alliance would. Is it possible that nowhere is safe on this continent? If you were a member of the Insect Tribe, what choice would you make? Honestly, though, doesn't help to endure things silently. I'd resist. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Indeed. What's the difference between losing freedom and being dead? If this is the case, the war will continue. I wonder where when it'll end. Honestly, though, like, at this point, what, is it really worth it? Like, is the peace, supposed peace, worth all of that? Yeah. Like, okay, they might as well be dead, honestly. Mm-hmm. 
Although you've chosen war, you actually want peace more than anybody else, right? This piece is one-sided. I want to speak to a liar. <laughs> Damn, okay. I can understand that you don't want to care about my feelings now. After all, I've told you so many lies. If you never want to talk to me again, I guess I deserve that. The war is still going on, it's just wearing a frilly dress. What should I do to make us get back to how we were? Yeah, it seems like war is still happening. General is right in one thing. War is still... It's still war. It's, it's gonna be war mm -hmm. eventually. It's gonna explode sooner or later. He's just waiting yeah. for it at this point. He doesn't give a shit anymore. The truth. Do you want to hear the truth? I... Well... <laughs> Okay. We're going to do chapter 2 today for well because uh, this is really interesting. Honestly, this is really interesting. Oh, okay, bye, R.E.I. Bye, Ray. <laughs> whatever, whatever that was. Goodbye. <laughs> An mm -hmm. old friend. Okay. Please don't be depressing again. Please don't be depressing again, I beg you. It will totally be depressing, I, I swear to God. Mm hmm I mean, someone has to tell someone that their child got recycle bend. Oh, she don't seem happy. <sighs> her, her, cat, her kid died, I think that's fair enough. Yeah. With well, the way she's acting, it seems like she blames her, though. Oh, yeah, for sure. But well, yeah. at least she doesn't want to talk to her. Yeah. Miss Gianama, you. How long will it be before you start talking to us again? It doesn't matter how you treat me, but you can't do this to the princess. My apologies. Princess, please eat. Thank you, Gianama. Those are some big chopsticks. Huge. Um, why aren't you eating, princess? Gianama, this food is completely raw. How could you give this to the princess? The princess doesn't wish to eat it. Chopsticks. Of course she can't eat it. The kitten tribe allocates a certain amount of food to each uh, to us each month. If I have to remake it, the princess will go hungry tomorrow. You are you threatening the princess? Forget it. I can still eat the vegetables. They don't need to be cooked. Princess, how can you? It's fine. No harm done. I'm sure all this cooking is tiring, Gianama. Why not head back to your room and rest? Okay, definitely blames her. Blames her. I know that Gianama is upset, but she can't take it out on you, Tindy. She's your nanny, but that doesn't mean she can give you an attitude. Her eyes were swollen. She must be thinking about Faida again. But that wasn't your fault. 
Honestly, it wasn't. She just happened to be there. It would have happened either way, honestly. Yeah, exactly. If blaming me makes it any easier for her, then let her blame me. But you're innocent. Innocent how? A tribe member is dead. I am a part of all this too. I don't have the right to be innocent. Princess! Hello! Sorry for uh, to roll up while you're eating. <laughs> <sighs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> Deja vu, I've been busy in this place before. Okay. <laughs> Or John, you and you again. And hello to you too, Tinka. I've come to chat with the princess. Hime? Princess, you look. If you have come here to ask me if I will act as shaman for the peace ceremony. My answer is the same as it was yesterday, the day before, and the day before that. I won't do it. I see. It's a shame you haven't changed your mind yet. I am a hostage, not a guest. I am not suited to serve as the Wind Shaman. I hope that my lord will not continue to put me in this position. Why, Princess? If it is because of that occurred at the Metamorphosis, it is more is it even more important now that that you serve as a shaman. To educate more beasts about you and the Isik tribe, this will bring about greater understanding and things will gradually improve. Is this guy naive or just stupid? Girl is seething in her portrait. Yeah. In any case, I, think, I hope you think about it some more. I will do my best to not let what we saw before happen again. Say, I haven't eaten yet. I wonder if I may have uh, have the honor of joining you. No, we... <laughs> Great. I'll tell my people to prepare. We can discuss things more as we eat. He noticed the food is raw. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, was that even a question? I don't think that was a question. <laughs> That was like, no, I don't think a, so either. That was a statement. <laughs> it's easy for him to speak about that which does not concern him. How am I supposed to bet the fate of my entire tribe on him and his efforts? But you can't destroy your relationship with him either. After all, this is his land. It says, let's have some tea. Let's have, have some tea before the meal. I brought some excellent tea leaves. <laughs> the shudder. <laughs> can't hit him. Can't yell at him. I seriously can't take this anymore. <laughs> the smug bastard is also fully aware that she wants to smack <laughs> him, but he's like, she <laughs> but she's like not. <laughs> Not holding mm -hmm. yourself back. He's not. He's not a blind. He's not blind. He's obviously aware that she wants to smack him half the time they're talking. <laughs> princess, princess. Oh, this music again. Mm -hmm. Tinko, what's the matter? You look pale. I just ran into Lord Yuan uh, Yuan Yun outside. He said he had some rare snacks. And that he would bring some to you later. Why the panic, though? <laughs> Again? Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh, Juan Vu, I've been seeing see the place before. <laughs> <laughs> Juan Vu. Deja Vu, Juan Vu. Our princess, calm down. <laughs> 
I can't <laughs> take this anymore. <laughs> I got it. Why not sneak out and get some fresh air? When John Yoon arrives, I'll distract him. Um, is that okay? Just leaving you two alone? If it were someone else, then maybe not. But Lord Kwan Yoon is harmless. He'll just, he'll probably just chat my ear off. But the security guard out back should be taking a nap about, right about now. I've got this. Hurry up and get out of here. <laughs> go, 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 go. <laughs> or you could stay here and enjoy some tea. <laughs> I'm leaving. I'm you leaving. have a Goodbye. point. <laughs> well then, I'll be going. <laughs> Thank you. Don't know what I'd do without you. Nothing. We've grown up together. I'm your faithful servant. Jo jolly, j jolly Jackson. What a relationship. Mm-hmm. He is taking it up. <laughs> he really is, yeah. Taking a little nippy nap. Lego. Parkour. Court parkour. Parkour. <laughs> Parkour. I bet the holy <laughs> dragon herself to give Dindo the strength to go full day as fueled. Okay, yeah. I'm not usually oh, I'm not usually able to travel this far without supervision. Good thing Tinko noticed that the guard takes afternoon naps. Such beautiful sights. No wonder Gianama wanted to tell her son all about them. Honestly, though, if you were stationed uh, around a, go a, a prisoner that doesn't want to escape, I doubt you would be so vigilant either. So <laughs> it's like, yeah, what's the point, really? Like, you know, I'm just gonna, I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm just gonna take a nap, really. <laughs> yeah. She must be devastated. Oh, hello. Uh oh, hello. Bug boy. Coming through. Uh, this echo, what it does is that it uh, creates a defensive bar barrier. Mm -hmm. Also, fun fact during the tail end of Mirage, we were shown a teaser stream for Eclipse where they show the set of silhouettes of future playable characters. Oh, really? Interesting. So apparently, at the end of the um, at the end of Mirage, they were shown they were shown a stream where all the future uh, with silhouettes with fu of future characters. Ah, oh, okay. Where only Tindo An and Jihasaha were revealed, and back then her name was Tinaris. Ooh, interesting. Yeah. 
It was changed to Tindumu on release. It was released, uh, it was uh, changed to Tinduimu at the start of the game. Oh, because her name was Tinaris. She was uh, Tinaris apparently before. Mm, I like Tinduimu better. Yeah, Tinduimu. It's been a long time since we sparred like this. I miss those days. Hello again, princess. I'm relieved to see you, that you that you look well. It's been so long. You're looking more and more like a soldier. Yes, and yet, I still salute the princess and the princess only. Still the same as ever. With your skill set, I'm sorry I just use you as my personal mailman. It's disrespectful. But I love being your personal mailman. It gives me a reason to come the see old you. name doesn't work with the naming scheme, I guess. It doesn't work with the naming scheme, yeah. This is the most recent letter from the king and queen. Princess, please have a look. Huh. Honestly, even right now, I'm thinking about it. I, I, I can't really see any good outcome to for anyone involved here. Mm -hmm. Like at least in uh, at least in like the um, in the Raj, you have you had a strong presence of Queen Diana and uh, Quite frankly, Laser did everything in his power to undermine the corrupt forces. Mm -hmm. Like, there is a lot. There was a lot of situ uh, things that were done behind the scenes, from what I can understand, that completely derailed both the Dragon Titans camp camp company uh, campaign and like any other corrupt forces. Even the fact that mm -hmm. even the fact that the Neo himself wanted to rebel. Not already completely derailed everything that the cultists wanted to achieve there. Though ultimately, in the end, uh, also Uzziah was there, so that's also yeah, something yeah. too. So, and he did he he came in clutch completely. Someone's trying to fix a leaking dam with band aids. Yeah, here this is just I don't know how this will work. Complex contradictions. Like I, need, I see no possible way it would actually like function how, somehow, because there is also dragon tines like that, that clearly will want to try to exploit the uh, the unrest the unrest to do whatever they, their thing are. There's the multitude of factions within the uh, within the um, Eastern Alliance that all want something. Constant in fighting, constant everything. Mm -hmm. Seeing you frown the three in the letter, could it be that? It's the same as before. Everything is fine at home, and the queen hopes I can focus on my duties. I see. Uh, these letters are all the same. Something isn't right. Clearly what happened at the Metamorphosis was a huge deal. G.S. Saha, is everything really going as smoothly as the letters make it seem? G.S. Saha! Do not make me lose your trust as well. I dare not conceal anything this from the princess. This is the biggest joke on the continent. Yeah, it seems like it. They're only rumors. The king and queen probably just didn't want to worry you. What part of rumors. yesterday was fine? Very well, if you must know. 
After what happened, some complained that you lacked discipline. Others berated the royal family for bowing to the East Alliance. However, both sides... ...are not satisfied with me serving as a political hostage. That is why I said you didn't need to worry. Oh wait, there's my theory right there. Oh, what is the what is that theory? The pressure that the East Alliance has put on everybody. People need someone to blame, and maybe it may have made you the scapegoat. You must be more aware of this than anyone. I understand, but. But Tinko So heavy, I I can't see in front of me. So it's safe to say John Yoon passed by. <laughs> mm, yeah. <laughs> the sparkles. bad faith or someone else entirely. Are you okay? <laughs> Jihasaha! And the princess! You're back! Uh, I think those letters are either being written in bad faith or someone else entirely. Oh, yeah. Um, I'm, oh, I'm, I'm, yeah. They might be fabricated. Like, I don't know what happened there, but, like, I don't... Hmm. I don't know. Uh, at this point, I don't even know if her parents are alive or anything, you know? Yeah. Not, I'm not sure if if they're even alive at this point. Hmm. And there's as always. I'm happy to see that. So nice to see you too, Jihasa. Huh? Have you come with another letter? Yes. And uh, what is all this? <laughs> Gifts from the Kitten Lord. He's trying to buy her favor. But they don't fit inside the house. After the Lord left, I wanted to organize everything, but... He left. Has he given up? Nope, he was actually super smiley. Said that since you weren't here, he'd return at nightfall. You... <sighs> Tindoima, uh, dear. You need to re realize that everything that can go wrong for you will go wrong, including the fact that this this one wheelchair motherfucker will not leave you alone. <laughs> <laughs> he's coming back. Ugh. I just imagine like several months passed and he's like, keep coming, kept coming every day, every day, every day. Hello, 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 hello. <laughs> <laughs> that's why she that's why at this point she's like ah! <laughs> is the Kirin Lord bothering the princess yeah and he won't give up no matter how much the princess refuses I need to learn from my mistakes. I can't keep I doing things that invite criticism. Letters, but I can't talk about this character for the short-term future. Hmm, I see, I see, I see. Okay, uh, tell me when we get to it. Who, who, who you think wrote those letters? I've got to think of some way to get out of this. Uh... 
Leave it up to me. I'll deal with this one for all. Put the beating stick down. Put the beating stick down. Let's not. Let's think about it. <laughs> let's not be rash. <laughs> yeah. No. He may be a pest, but he is the esteemed lord of the Kirin tribe. And? I'll take care of it without anyone finding out. Yeah. It's not just that. He is virtuous. His intentions align with his actions. Compared to others in the East Alliance, I've met these past nine years. He's truly worthy of being called a good person. I cannot harm a good person for my own well-being. Aww. Princess! Says that's how you feel. You don't disagree. Words like these are what caused me to follow you in the first place. How could I disagree? But if Lord Huan Yun never gives up... Let's not be so hasty, Tindo. Really, this is the Chinese court we're talking about. Yeah, I, I agree. I agree. I don't think. I don't think he. Uh, I don't think she, I don't. Th uh, he does have a, a reason for his actions right now, although I don't think at this moment his actions are m mean any harm to um, princess or the tribe at this point. At this point in time, mm -hmm. he clearly has. Maybe mm -hmm. he oh. clearly has his own agenda, but still, <clears throat> but still. Yasaha, Tinko, I think I've got a plan. Okay, huddle, so, what, huddle, huddle. <laughs> so what is the plan? It sounds dangerous, uh, but I will obey the princess. I'll go see who I can find. Thank you both. The be this big scheme <laughs> to, to, to avoid the playboy. <laughs> oh, man. No, I, uh... Why do you, why did you... Bro is already plotting. Why, why, why the fuck did they, did they turn to 69 about, right now, of all, of all places? <laughs> <laughs> nice. <laughs> nice. <laughs> nice. Okay. Very nice. Bro is actually plot is already plotting. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Shit. Uh welcome feast. Sixty nine. Sixty nine. Okay, so we have uh Kirin. Oh, we had like the Kirin Lord, the Tindoimu. Nice. Nice. And then uh, Juha Saha. Okay. Here, here, I raise my glass to the princess. Thank you for your generous invitation. I'm honored to attend this welcome feast for your guests from home and enjoy a wonderful night with you all. <laughs> what, what, is, what are you staring for? <laughs> It is only due to the Kirin tribe's generosity that Jihisaha was able to come here. It is us who are honored. She says grumpy. <laughs> Begrudgingly. <laughs> Begrudgingly. Like there's a grumpy face on her va uh, facial expression. <laughs> oh. 
Actually, I told the princess that the other day you waited all afternoon for her. She felt bad and figured you should come tonight. Oh, Tinko, you didn't need to bring that up. Oh, I see. I was wondering why the princess went out of her way to invite me. He's like, yes, I'm breaking her down. Yes. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Tinimo, you don't have to feel bad. It was my choice, wink. <laughs> wink, wonk. Yeah. Uh, oh, yes, of course. <laughs> if he doesn't get sus... Uh, assassins! They're an assassin! She's like, I got this. Got this. We got this. Let's fight. Ooh, nice. Okay. Oh, nice. Okay. Uh, let's do this. Okay. <laughs> Dig. <laughs> nice. <laughs> <laughs> This fake assassin is so weak. Tinko, you couldn't find anyone more believable? Mm. Ugh. Uh, how do you... No, here's my chance. Princess of the Insect Tribe, you shall be buried here today. Are you okay? Damn. After him. Oh. <laughs> Apologies, you're an esteemed guest of Kulin tribe and these incidents keep, keep occurring within our borders. I'll catch this as in, I give you my word. Juhazaha, please keep her safe. Nah, that failed. Yeah, didn't think he'd risk his life for me like that. Yeah, seriously. That happened twice already. Looks like the princess plan has... Jiasaha, it's up to you now. Princess, perhaps we should think it's over. Just do it before they come back. She's gonna like fake her death. Yes, Princess. Oh. Ah! Not fake her death. She's done. The, she's gonna do the uh, the hardcore thing of like, let me heart myself real quick. Hmm. Princess, the assassin scaled the wall and escaped. I'm afraid I've lost him. Oh, didn't you promise you were gonna catch him? Are you hurt? How could this be? I think there were others hiding here. They emerged after you left, catching us off guard. Thankfully, Gia Saha was here. He was able to force them out. No, I was much too careless. I wasn't able to tranquilly the princess, the princess. Please punish me for my in ineptitude. Yeah. No, both of us were careless. 
having a feast outside like this. We are, we are far too exposed. Should have anticipated this. More importantly, uh, how's her injury, Doctor? The muscle and bones have not been affected, but she will need at least a month's rest. It would be best to refrain from moving too much, so the wound does not tear. Does that mean the wind shaman? Obviously, it would be terrible of me to force you. It is most important that you heal. I suppose with Himawari will have to be the wind shaman now. Yes, Miss Himawari is best suited for the... Uh... Princess, you need to rest. Yes. Guards, please help the princess back to her quarters. Thank you, Lord Wanyun. She went that far for it, huh? Mm-hmm. Damn. I never thought she'd go to such great lengths to refuse me. She didn't realize her own potential. I truly hope that she mm. had more faith in uh, she she can have more faith in herself. She's not a dumbass. She she obviously he obviously knows what happened. Mm -hmm. He yeah, obviously understands what happened. That's that's one thing I can give her him. A lot of people who are considered cripples are often smarter than everyone else think they are. Mm -hmm. Like, look at, like, Tyrion from uh, Game of Thrones. Yeah. When you have a deficiency in some sort, you compensate by other means. Yeah. Peace ceremony. Oh, yeah. Uh, and, and see, she, Himawari is probably very happy about it. Also, Himawari. I just realized Tiger Tribe Himawari Japanese name. So yeah, apparently the fire sect is definitely inspired by Japan. Japan. Mm -hmm. Definitely, definitely inspired by Japan. Uh, I just also realized that the Arbiter cannot be axolotl because all of them, all of the mythical tribes are the fictional. Animals, not real animals. Ah, oh, yeah. Princess, does your leg hurt? Maybe you should walk slower. This injury isn't like your sprain before. I saw blood this time. It's already a lot better. Jihasaha was careful. Isn't the peace ceremony tomorrow? Tinko, why don't you and the princess go together? Eh? Can we? Why not? You've both been stuck in this house for days. It's making me antsy. Sometimes I need a my uh, sometimes I need time alone too. It's chilly outside. I've stitched a shawl for you for the princess. Don't forget to take it with you. Gianama, for me? Eh. And don't forget to take Gia Saha so he doesn't keep bothering me. That country boy has never seen the world. Hmm. Very peculiar. Peculiar, yeah. Looks like Giannama's getting back to normal. Oh, I doubt that. Mm, yeah, I'm sus. I'm suspicious about this. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I hope so. I am entirely suspicious of this. 
She is. She's even worried about GSI. Yeah, I am suspicious about this. I'm not sure what what's her what's mm -hmm. her end here. But it's surprising that she isn't going to the peace ceremony. She used to love going. What happened to Fayid probably changed her mind. Well, what do you think? Do you want to go? I suppose so. Let's give Gianama a night off. And I bet you'd love to spend some time with Giyasaha, right? Hey! Is it- is that- that obvious? I'll go get him then. <laughs> Damn lovebirds. <laughs> Kind of not surprised, honestly, considering things. He was always, like, hanging around the princess. She's a princess servant. Uh, he's a big, handsome guy. Big, strong, handsome guy that, is, that cares about princess and everyone around her princess. So, yeah, I kind of I figured something along those lines would happen. Mm -hmm. Kind of figured. <laughs> Tindoyim is clearly ha clearly has nothing on that of the sort on her mind, but uh, her servant does, probably. I mean, she's still, like, a Pretty much a teenager at this point. Well, not teenager, mm -hmm. like a slightly older than teenager, young adult, so. <laughs> oh, it's so busy. Last time must have been three years ago, right? And this time it's in Pehua City. China. So this is the peace ceremony. Kid drop kick the soldier. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, is that? Oh! <laughs> Hi, Joshin. Hey, Joshin. Uh, <laughs> you okay there? <laughs> kind of reminds me of that circus performance. Oh, wait. She, they saw Sophie. She saw Sophie. Apparently. Yeah, it reminds me of the of the attacks the uh, Sophie's group used. The, the ball, the sliding on, the, on top of things. Mm-hmm. Hey, slow down. Stay where we can see you. If you're up to something, the next time your princess won't be allowed outside. Want to say that again, buddy? It's fine. We'll just walk slower. We're here to see the ceremony. Don't let people like that bring us down. Oh boy, oh boy, the dance is starting. The best part is that of the ceremony is always the, the shamans. I've been waiting forever. So excited. <laughs> the water shaman is definitely going to be Miss Sho So Hyun, right? Duh, she's the best dancer in the East. I've run to three different cities just to watch her dance. That's one dedicated guy considering they don't, they don't have cars. <laughs> <laughs> that just guy. Imagine just like just like in the middle of the forest, just this this coyote dude just like <laughs> just fucking running. She got beautiful dance moves for sure, but she's engaged. Me, I've got my auntie Yuki. <laughs> it's a shame that she's not attending the ceremony. I had to lady P. What did I miss? Did you hear that? The dance is about to start. Let's go!
Turtle Man, you are old enough to be their grandfathers. Uh, I had to. I had to. Lady P, what did I miss? You missed. Uh, you missed uh, Princess Tindoima being hardcore again and going like, uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna slash my own, my own, my myself here just to stop myself from coming to the ceremony and before being the shaman, I'm gonna injure myself again. <laughs> And the nanny being totally sus. And the nanny being totally suspicious all of a sudden, and suddenly being, like, oh, don't go to the, the the ceremony. Go right now. Here's the here's the thing I did for you randomly. Here, here you go. Take that. Don't forget to take that with you, or something like that. Something like that, yeah. Go, calm down. Wait. Stop, I told you not to run. When I see Miss Surion dance too, damn it. <laughs> Did we miss it? I think it, I don't think it started yet. Yeah, I don't think so. No, it's just starting. Oh? Fawning over engaged women, my dudes, Moai. Moai. <laughs> yeah. Though, to be fair, she is pretty. Mm hmm. Even with the veil on. Yeah. That is very clearly a human. That person isn't looking at the stage. Oh, Great God. observation. Good observation. <laughs> also, oh, God, it's the purple close again. Mm -hmm. oh, Are they on. looking at the crowd? I can't see too clearly, but it looks like a member of the insect tribe. Purple man, F in AF. You also noticed? Can't be sure, but if if it really is a member of our tribe, and they're planning something here. He's trying to escape. Get him. <laughs> Princess Jihasaha, where are you going? I want to. Oh. Yeah. Hmm. Should we be leaving Tinko alone? It'd be too dangerous for her here. Relax. Tinko Tinko will be fine. Yeah. Purple man, Flaff? No, more of them. Of course there'll be more of them. Who are you? Why are you sticking your nose in our business? My name is Tinduimo. I don't know what you're planning, but as princess of the insect tribe, I order you to stop. If someone from our tribe ruins the East Alaska ceremony, then our already strained relationship will. Insect tribe?
We are servants of the Almighty's Dorica. You have no affiliate. We have no affiliation with you bugs. You're not from the insect tribe? It appears they're humans from the West. Doesn't matter who we are. You're both about to die here. You won't interfere. Oh. Okay. Okay, let's see. Okay. Okay. Done. Done, 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 done. After them. They're gone. Was that an explosion? Let's go. Okay. Okay. What is happening here? What is happening here? I mean, I'm not surprised they want to disturb the uh, peace ceremony. Broken tranquility. Uh, was there a tranquility? I am unsure. Like sounds like we're close. Okay, this time we'll catch him. Oh, it's just fireworks. It's just fireworks. Handsome wolf man. Oh, handsome kitty man. <laughs> you. Oh, I've been found out. Hmm? What are you doing here? As you can see, I'm setting up fireworks. Why would the Kirin Lord need to sneak around like this, playing with children's toys? Well, it is exactly because people are always telling me they're children's toys uh, to act more like a lord. That I have no choice but to be sneaky. <laughs> They're so beautiful, so different from ordinary fireworks. 
craftsman who made these uh, is the best in the East. Well, was the best in the East. He actually stopped making them a long time ago. <laughs> but he made these special for today, just for Arbiter Mayok. Wow, so rare. Yep. And to be able to enjoy these here with the princess, I guess it was worth stealing them from the stage. Oh. <laughs> As always, the Lord loves to joke around. You think that was a joke? <laughs> oh, that. By the way, is your injury getting any better? It's still painful, but at least I'm able to walk a bit. I'm sorry, I didn't mean let you get hurt. It was the assassin. It wasn't your fault. He's like, assassin, right. Here, this is a medicine I had foreign, a foreign friend of, me, of mine may bring me. It's said to be miraculous. Please take it. Inko, I'm sorry they stopped me and accused us of trying to flee. Think you, you can all run away? After this, none of you will be allowed to outside again. Let's go. Boy. Harassing this young lady right before my eyes, do you want me to lose face right in front of the princess? Lord, we didn't see you there. So if, if if I weren't here, then you'd continue to mistreat this young woman. The Sullies are the reputation of our tri tribe immensely, and you have the, uh, still not released Miss Tinko. Yes, sir. They didn't hurt you, did they? I'm fine. I'm very grateful for Lord Huan Yun. But I still don't understand why he's keep why he's getting so worked up. Tinko's yeah, I know. Legs. Tinko's tangling legs. She's like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Listen here, women should be treated with the utmost. Oh. Ah, oh, the medicine. Oh, what happened? Oh my goodness. Oh. Lord, be careful. What is this? What is happening? Heart. They're monster infected? I guess. They're coming. Monster. This is a weird. What is this? Wolf commoner. It doesn't say monster infected. Mm -mm. What is this? What the hell is happening? Confusion. <laughs> okay. 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 Okay, let's see. Got him. Hmm. 
Void disease corrupts soul uh, energy. Uh, if you recall, those people have been bewitched. Have those they have Why did they suddenly? Oh, right. Void disease corrupts soul energy. Beasts don't have soul energy. Oh. They have chi. So what the That's right. That's right. Bewitched. Don't worry about that now. Let's get back to the main street and find some people to help. They see me rolling. They're hating. <laughs> <laughs> okay. What is happening here? What is this? <laughs> Soulless behavior. Soulless behavior. Soulless behavior. Oh, mm -hmm. clearly something is happening. Uh oh. Move according to our orders. Do not run astray. Do not push or shove. Quit looking around. Get out of here as fast and get somewhere safe. What's happening? What? We're friends! They came charging in. If they don't run, if, they, if, if we don't run, they'll catch up with us. Grandpa, mommy. Uh. Oh. Help! Somebody's been killed. Oh no. Hi, I'm Juan Yun, Lord of the Quillen Tribe. Could you please tell us what is going on here? Lord of the Kirin tribe? What are you doing here? Something even happened at the pit ceremony you didn't hear? What? No time to explain. Hurry up and follow the crowd. Those clothes, like from the ceremony, it's Miss Su Hyun of the Kyo tribe. What? Is that really So Hyun? Uh, oh, she's oh, she's being wow. chased. And she's been chased, yeah. Eh, <laughs> those people all have been bewitched. Run! They're headed this way. Can we save her? Tian, 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 help! We must. She's a good person. Are you eating there? Show me the snack. <laughs> I love how she makes that distinction as if were they not good people, she would grab popcorn instead. I mean, to be fair, consider this is a uh, this is like this is like the um, what's it called. This is the alliance. I think she doesn't have much friends over here.
Okay, let me see this. Okay. Can you stop eating? <laughs> God damn it. Hey, nom 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 nom. Nom 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 nom. Bonk. Bonk. Oh, I see what it does. Uh, it, it automatically responds with attack. I am cursed beyond all reasoning. I must eat turnip. Yes, I must. F I must nom. I nom, therefore I exist. <laughs> I'm cursed beyond all existence. I might. I must eat a, a turnip. <laughs> Can you stop eating? <laughs> okay, let's see. Every time she ulting, she she bitch slapped Johnny. And what is this? <laughs> <laughs> She's taking out her regression on him. <laughs> Every time she ults, if there is a Juan Yun in the party, which most likely there is, he he gets bitch slapped. Not Jihasaha, but <laughs> Juan Yun specifically. That's interesting. <laughs> <laughs> It's very interesting, actually. Okay. Okay, then. Okay, okay, okay. Final one, Water Shaman. Mm-hmm. Man. That's just that's just first two chapters, and it's already been more than three hours, actually. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so fair enough. I guess we are going to be doing two chapters at a time. The fights are fairly fairly challenging as well. Mm hmm. Suhyun, are you okay? I... I'm fine. Thankfully, I ran into you. Thank you for your help. Would you run... Why did you run here all alone? Did the dances end? Where's Young Yun? I... I was looking for something. Young Hyun was here, but we were separated. Anyway, I should keep looking. You can't just run back in there. No, it's too dangerous out here. Out there, what's so important? My talisman. Talisman? The one you're always carrying? Yes, I looked all through the crowd, but I still couldn't find it. What am I supposed to do if I lose it? Mama. Don't cry, don't cry. There's no need to get worked up. How about look, it for, uh, look for it for you, with you? Not a good idea. Those people who, are, who just attacked us, they were bewitched. There must be a bewitcher around, and if we run into them... Jinhuimu, Wanyun, please let me go! That... that talisman is very, very important to me. I... I can't lose it. Mm. 
I'm not trying to stop you. I'm just saying way to... What are you doing to Kong Song Hyun? Oh, and hello. A, hello, another another young. Oh, speaking of, this is the, the guy had named Young Hyun. Yeah. This is the one they thought she was with. Catch these hands, boy. <laughs> uh, oh god, it's Naruto's voice actor. <laughs> it's Naruto's voice actor. I immediately realize uh, I immediately recognize this. <laughs> Believe it. Do you hear it too? Do you hear it? Am I, am I the only one hearing it? <laughs> oh, uh, I have difficulty hearing the voices because uh. my Discord's messed up. Uh. Young Hyun, it's not what you think. They've done nothing. What are you trying to fool? Look at you. You're crying. Your face is a mess. Are you trained or not? And, and you're saying you've, they've done nothing? I do believe this guy is a legit axolotl. My face is a mess. Really, it's a misunderstanding. Tinduimu and Wan Yun just saved me. Lord Yuan Yun? Hello, Young Hyun. Yes, I've been here this whole time. <laughs> it really is the Lord. I was so panicked, I didn't even realize it was you. See now? They're helping me. I was nervous about to go look for my talisman again, but they said it was too dangerous. They stopped me. Oh, right. Your talisman. I've got it right here. Oh. Hmm. You found it. Thank you so much. I finally found it in the crowd. Took me ages. Keep it somewhere safe, will ya? Well then, so Hyun can be at ease now. Yes, thank you again for your help. Wait a second, so Hyun, you gotta be more careful. I'll say it right from up front, I'm not as naive as So Hyun. You may have saved her, but it doesn't mean you're innocent. Innocent? Show some respect, punk. Let's all remain calm. Young Hyun, did you say innocent? Did something happen? You still don't know? General Yu of the Tiger Tribe was assass assassinated of, at, the, at the peace ceremony. Oh, shit. What? And the killer's still out there. Everybody's afraid there's, a, there's an insect assassin. That's where they're, they're all running for their lives. Hold on. If you haven't caught the assassin, then why assume it's someone from the insect tribe? We will. Because it, because General Yu was the one he was the great hero finally managed to suppress those rotten bugs, 
and he patrolled the insect borders without mercy, punishing all who stood in his way. Who else could be, could it be if, if but one of those maggots? Yeah, yeah, baby, that's what I'm talking about. Jungian, you can't just falsely accuse others. Why are you defending him? Aren't you afraid of the insect tribe? I'm afraid of them, but Princess Tinduimu isn't one who attacked Mom all those years ago. So Yun is right, Young Hyun. You have no proof. It's rather not right to wildly accuse others. No proof? Son Hyo, didn't you see the assassin? I didn't see them clearly. There were too many people. Damn it, damn it. If I chased him, they wouldn't have gotten away. It's all your fault for making me look for the stupid talisman. I I'm sorry, I was so scared. Then you freak out and run all over the place. How was I supposed to find you? What if I run into those bewitchers? How do you feel then, huh? <laughs> Young Kyo, you can't lose your temper in a woman. I admit I made a mistake, but I didn't force you to help me. Young Yoon, why are you always so mean to me? I, ugh, taking you is impossible. Point is, I'm bringing the bug bruises in for questioning. Absolutely not. You want the princess, then you have to get me through me first. Where are you taking me? Oh. Shut up. Who said you could ask questions? That voice. Is that... Chianama? Oh, maybe it was her. But... Ah, you did this you. Oh, but you can't just snatch up people as you... as you like. You need a reason. I told you to shut up, lady. You deaf? Stop it! Chianama, wake up! What... What makes you monsters think you can just... Lord of the Quillen tribe, John, unit, your service. How you fine fellows doing? By the, by the look of this office, your target tribe special forces. The elite of the elite. Mm -hmm. The mythical Kirin tribe? What business does the Lord, the, the, the Quillen Lord have with us? Mm. It's like this. This woman is the insect tribe princess, Nanny. They're under my super the supervision of my tribe. They can't leave Quillen to Kirin territory. So I must ask, I must ask, where are you two taking her and whose commands are you following? Recently, when our troops were act, out, out capturing uh, members of the insect tribe's resistant movement, there were several times when they knew of our actions beforehand. The, the brilliant general Yu suspected that someone was leaking military information to the enemy. Could it be? The general has been out of on, of on war expeditions for many years. That he returned to attend the ceremony is just an excuse. He actually returned to catch them all. And the insect is one of those spies. Jianama is a spy? No, that's impossible. That would endanger every member of our tribe. Gentlemen, there must be some sort of some mistake. That will all be determined after we bring her to General Yu for questioning. Oh. You two were just in, in Kirin territory and you still haven't heard? Mm -hmm. Huh? I That's... unashamedly leapt out of my chair in joy when they killed off you off screen. Good riddance. Huh? You got something to say? Then say it. 
General Yu has been assassinated. What the? Say that again? Okay. What the heck? Huh. Okay, then. Damn. Well, damn, then. Uh... Yeah. Oh, okay. Already things are developing. Mm-hmm. That was incredibly ironic. Didn't think that Tinduima would go that far to refuse being a shaman. I hope everyone can leave it in peace. Mm -hmm. The peace dance is a way of praying for peace. It would be great if everyone could realize the true meaning when participating in the ceremony. If it moves one person, then it would still be meaningful. You're not telling you uh, the truth. I refuse to speak. He's like, he's. Am I? Am I Tsundere now? The peace dance is for peace. <laughs> I understand your feeling of wanting to know the truth. However, it's not always a thing to know. That ignorance is this. Before you explain who you really are, there is nothing else to talk about. Even if the truth is cruel, you'd still want to know. Really? You still want to find out? I understand. It all started 1,000 years ago. When you were once called Vindacti. Really now? Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Huh. Kirin Calamity. <sighs> hmm. Okay. Did you collect your words from the chapters? Yeah, I'm gonna do that right now. Okay. Oh, nine chapters. Cool lord. Oh my goodness. Oh, don't forget the end of season one. Yeah, yeah. Wow. Who no. Exactly did the no, no, no. You don't need to remind me. I wanted to. I wanted to actually bring it up. Thank you. For, thank you for uh, the segue, Eggy. Uh, I think she's lying too. Again. Yeah. I mean, if she's lied to us in the past, what's to say she won't this. lie to us think again? Think about this. Um. The, when the flashback happened in chapter in the end of uh, Sunset, um, mm -hmm. the um, error was referring to Vidacti not true when speaking of race dialogue. Mm -hmm. And then we we then we um, had a had an image of her as well in the armor and with the with the spear later. Mm -hmm. So she is Vidacti. Yeah. But then who are we? Yeah. She's Vindacti, but she tries to say that we are Vindacti. Why is she so trying Maybe. so hard to impose this on us? Maybe it's like a like a like a de decoy, is that the word? Where it's like a she's trying to make you believe that because it's far from the truth. It's like a like a ruse. Like a ruse, huh? Okay. Yeah. That's the million dollar question. Who are we? Yeah, that's the million dollar question. Who are we? That is the, like one of the biggest mysteries right now for... Uh... Who are we that Vindacti would do this to us? Yeah, who are we that Vindacti would do this to us? That's a good question. Like, what is this? What is happening mm -hmm. right now? Yeah. <sighs> okay, so... This was even, even an even bigger train wreck than I thought it would be, objectively. <laughs> yeah. Like, this is much 
much bigger than I thought it would be. What do you think what will happen next? Because this is a... Uh, uh... Okay, so we have several moving pieces. We have the Eastern Alliance and their eternal corruption. We have the insect tribe, apparently resistance that exists, which is unsurprising. Um, we have the assassination of General Yu. Mm -hmm. We have clearly Dragon Tines being there. And I'm, sure, I'm not sure mm -hmm. if, they, if they're involved in this or not. Uh, like, I doubt they even give a sh I, They didn't seem to give a shit about the situation. They're just off doing their own business there. Which leaves me mm -hmm. questioning what the fuck are they doing there in the first place. Yeah. We have the situation with the Queen Diana and Queen Angelia as well. Someone sent them oh, bombs yeah. under the official pretense of, of summoning to championship. Mm -hmm. So clearly we'll have envoys from both kingdoms right around now. Now that we're here, how do you feel about the Alliance? Yeah. How do we feel about the Alliance? Uh, I don't know. Like, I don't... I don't think they're, like, entirely the good guys in this. I mean, if at all. Yeah, they're, they don't seem... They're, 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 uh, it has been mentioned before. We've that... seen a bit, but I understand it. My stance is still a bit strong. No, no, I can totally get it. Um... They're corrupt, clearly. They are uh, vain, mm -hmm. lying, uh, in incredibly racist. <laughs> yeah. Incredibly racist. For sure. Yeah. Like, they have this hypocritical attitude towards, like, uh, towards everything. Like, if, uh, if, if something bad happens to us, we can take revenge, but we can do everything, whatever bad, bad, anything bad, the, anything bad happens to you, that's all your, that's, that's your fault. Yeah, yeah. Kind of attitude that I just, like, that is infuriating. It's, it's the, mm -hmm. is that completely infuriating, completely insufferable court scenario. I think that is just like, oh my god. Oh man, this is a... Uh... I feel like this uh, season will exhaust us both really well. <laughs> uh... <laughs> no, yeah, it's... Uh... Of course, this is just the perspective given by the military. Yeah, I kind of realized that the common folk. I don't think the common folk experience nearly as much of the, uh, nearly as much I of the. I want you guys to see the situation of the common folk. Nearly as much of the corruption that the higher echelons experience, because normal folk don't mm -hmm. give a shit usually. Like right, like taxes, obviously. There is other things that they're suffering from, but it's not nearly as destructive, I'd say. Also, the bewitching bewitchers. What what the fuck does that mean? Yeah. I'm wondering uh, if it's some sort of parallel to the monster corruption, but then yeah, but then what it when it went where where did it came where did it come from then? Yeah, because visually it looks the same as the it monster looks, yeah, similar, corruption. Yeah. They just don't have the growth yeah. the monster growths on them, unlike the monster corrupted yeah. citizens. Yeah. Void sickness can be only acquired by your uh, soul energy corrupted. Then bewitchment mm -hmm. can be acquired by your chi energy corrupted. Hmm. I assume so, at least. Hmm. Yeah. It's, uh... Well, clearly we'll have to decide... Uh, clearly they will try to accuse Tinto Imu of, 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 of assassinating... Um, yeah, you. I guarantee it they, they will try to. That's a I mean, stance to take a they, they have I you, the a, state of I guess, a reasoning we why she could have done it, because she was mind. there when he killed the child, and she was very upset about that. Mm -hmm. So they could claim that she did it out of revenge, even though she didn't. Yeah, uh, but thankfully, uh, that's, actually, that's actually a plus in her court, but um, they won't be able to accuse her. Uh, but because both uh, Song Hyung and um, and Joan Yoon were there, 
and they saw her mm -hmm. running around not being not assassinating the, the general <laughs> mm -hmm. yeah and she was clearly not aware of what was happening so i guess they can plead the, plead her case um i definitely think it might have been um it might have been the nanny who did it i yeah i was gonna say i think it might have been the nanny that did it and then she Honestly, though, to the princess, the to Tindinimu, as either a cover-up or to place blame on her. Yeah, or um, or the two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's uh, she. She definitely has the motive. It's definitely revenge. Yeah, definitely revenge. She, she might have been contacted by the resistance, and like, yeah, you hey, mm -hmm. yo, you want to take revenge? Do that, and she did it. She clearly was there. Yeah. She was there, so. They caught her somewhere mm -hmm. around there, because they were coming from the yeah. from the Quillin territory, uh, from the um, insect territory to Quillin territory, to like report. Yeah, to and the she general. was supposed to be by herself yeah. in the in the palace or wherever. Gianama. Gianama. Gianana. Yeah, Gianama. She has the most to gain. She has the most to gain, yeah. She has the most to gain about everything. Um, plus, grief-stricken mothers can do a lot of things. Yeah. <sighs> well, I hope... Oh, uh, I hope the... They can basically... Uh, at least the Arbiter seems to be more or less... Normal. She's not, like, mm -hmm. evil or anything. Yeah. Um, so as, as of right now, I do hope that, um, she manages to, like, help, uh, Tindoimu here mm -hmm. out of the situation, at least, but I don't really know. There is also the uh, martial arts tournament. Yeah. That is approaching after this. I have a lot of words about the Arbiter, not really specifically about Mayak, but that's for another time. Mayak, yeah, Mayak. Um, I think what will happen, um, I'm not sure exactly how this will lead to it, but uh, considering we've seen... Um, have they told you what the tournament is for? No, they haven't yet. Have they told you what the tournament is for? Uh, we, all, we, all, we only know that every tribe needs to have a representative on the tournament. Uh, but I assume it's something really important. Mm -hmm. Because uh, father, uh, the um, father of John Yoon is trying to find um, an outside help for the Kirin, Kirin representative. Because obviously mm -hmm. his son is a wheel wheelchair bound. <laughs> yeah. Person. So uh, clearly that means that it is important enough to participate in. Hmm. Hmm. Martial arts tournament. Hmm. Interesting. What I wonder. I guess we will learn why. But I, just that's just a guess in the dark. But somehow, uh, Tindoimi will end up participating in the tournament in Quillin's. Uh, oh yeah. Um. Or at least in her own tribe's stead, because we did see that poster with uh, Himawari, um, Miranda, and her square enough. Mm-hmm. Hmm. A lot of my points about the Arbiter is tied to the tournament, lol. Oh, nice. But yeah, I think she will end up participating in the tournament. Um, so will Pang. Pang was in that shot, too. Pang, Pang will also be there, I'm guaranteed. Uh, Pang will be there. Um, Miranda will be there. Um, Tindo Imu mm -hmm. will be there. Uh, Himawari will be there. Mm -hmm. Which is interesting. Hmm. It's going to be a really big uh, shake-up. Whatever it is. Um, yeah. They did mention Chiyuki. Uh, which we do have Chiyuki, I think. She's like an entertainer in the... In the East Alliance, apparently. Yeah, mm. there, he, there she is. Chiuki. Oh, she's cute. Very cute, yeah. 
Hanazo no Chiyuki. Yeah, she's from the Fire Tribe. I'm saying, I'm, I'm, I'm figuring because she um, Japanese inspired name. Mm hmm. Hmm. Yeah, I'm definitely curious to see what will happen next. Definitely, definitely. Because honestly, though, uh, all things considering, oh, what character unlocked? What, 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 who, who, which character unlocked? Let me see. Oh, Jihazaha. You can do Jihazaha now. Oh. Nice. And Tidemo. Mm. Nice. No, oh, there is also Young So Young. So Yun. She's she's here. Misa. Who's the, I don't know who that is. Oh yeah, we haven't seen him yet. Hmm. I am definitely excited to what, what happens next. Mm -hmm. I'm cautiously excited because I'm like she, things will go um She was with Puggin in that shot. Yeah. Pa Puggy was Puggy was also there. <laughs> Puggy was also in <laughs> fact there. Uh Chiyuki uh, with with Puggy. Ah oh, man, I'm not like I'm like wondering what the hell was, will happen. Yeah. I collect basically dailies today. Mm hmm. Hmm. So money. This game really likes to abuse Tindu Ima, doesn't she? Doesn't it? <laughs> yeah. I'm pretty sure they will continue. This game will continue to abuse Tindu Ima. <laughs> Fairly certain. <laughs> yeah. Fairly certain. Oh, nice. It's a uh, be mean to Tindu Ima hours. Yeah, be mean to Tindu Ima hours. I guess. Um... We're gonna do a final roll for today and then conclude. Okay. Which one? Uh, Echo. 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 Bunk. Bunk. Oh, purple. Ooh. Purple. Purple. Girl has passive armor generation for a reason. Yeah, I figured. Oh, Miranda. Hmm. Sidus units are key to crap. Well, they're, they're cute at least, so. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Let me see, let me see, because I can actually transform her right now. Probably, no. Oh, yeah, I can. Let me, let me, let me, let me raise her status here real quick. Mm -hmm. Miranda. Uh, book. Actually, let's buy, let's buy two. Let's buy two. Pop and cherry are decent at least. Let's go. <laughs> Yo. Ooh. Yeah. Not the lines. <laughs> Damn. And then you. Yeah. 
<laughs> the thigh crusher. I'm sure, I'm sure someone will be very, um, very excited about the prospect of that happening. <laughs> the thigh crusher. Oh, yeah. My mind is in three directions with yell. In three directions with Yao? <laughs> yeah, Yao, um, at least from what we know so far of him. God, I wish that was me. Yao tried to rebel. He was the one who tried to rebel against the corruption. And he, his rebellion was crushed. So, wondering how. Is he even still alive at this point, or is this like one of those characters that are alive that are alive in the past? And he does—he looks like he's alive because he's like all draped in, like, like hiding out, like he's almost in hiding. You know, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. See what I mean? He's like in hiding right now. Yeah. He's like in hiding. So clearly, something happened there. But okay, so assuming he's alive. Um, he's also a factor. Mm -hmm. Then, because he's clearly he's clearly angry. <laughs> I can say that for sure. He's clearly angry. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, but his hooded forms are younger than his SSR. Really? Twenty-five. Twenty-five. 25? Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, uh, it's... It, it's raw. He kind of like... I feel like uh, he might resort to some extreme measures in order to achieve what he wants. Yeah. I mean, look at, look at him. He looks like... He looks, he looks already completely done with everyone. He's desperate at this point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. When, when winning by normal means did not work, I think he will resort to uh, two bad of actions in order to... But yeah, still, considering the uh, life of, like, normal citizens, we look at Beata, and she's uh, clearly not okay. That's strange. Did they change for spoilers? Mm -hmm. Yeah, like, look at her. Surrounded by metals and cages and everything. Bones, rib cages. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Well, well, I'm excited to see what will happen next, but I think we'll stop. We'll be stopping for now. Mm -hmm. Four hours in. That's the longest start of the Cheddar. Is the longest start of an arc I have ever had. Yeah. Longest start of an arc because, like, usually we did like three chapters and it was enough. Uh, but apparently it wasn't. So, ooh, nice mm -hmm. money. We got money. Mm, money. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's sure. Um, since I got, since I got, since, since we get we got the money, I'm gonna be indulging my gacha addiction one more time. Okay. <laughs> Go for it. <laughs> one more time. One more time. I indulge my, indulge in my gacha addiction. <laughs> Do it. <laughs> Angelia. Roger. More Angelia. Kitty eyes. Nolva. Naya. Call. Oh. Beata. Nice. More Beata. Mm. And Call. Mm -hmm. More Beata. Mm, fairly certain we can raise her. No. 
Ah, yeah, no. Okay. Later, then. Okay, then. Yeah. That's good. We're going to be concluding here. Thank you guys for uh, watching. Don't look at the time, please. Uh, don't call me out on that. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I'm gonna be. We're gonna be going. Uh, see you guys around tomorrow. Limbus Company. Tomorrow, Limbus <laughs> Company, Chapter Four. Finally, we're gonna be catching up to the final chapter that it came out since down since uh, release. But yeah, see you guys. See you around, guys. Around, and see you guys next week and tomorrow as well and next week. Okay, bye. <laughs> Bye-bye! <laughs>